Let's see if we can get this game to work. Hello? There it is. Wonderful. Um, <clears throat> so, there have been some updates to this game. Oops, I turned my music down all the way. That's no good. There we go. Um, let me take a look. So, there was a recent update. There was a recent update. We added some restockers. So people can restock the shelves for me, which I don't know if I want that to happen. Because I kind of like the mess of doing it all myself. But maybe when the store gets bigger. Um, they added labels to all the shelves to show the product information. Added cleaning, clearing labels from empty shelves. Um... By clicking on the label, I don't necessarily know what that means, but I guess we'll figure out as we do it. Uh, new mirror checkout counter. Okay. Um, added placement for soda, yogurt, beer, butter, beef, and steak. Added selling boxed up furniture by holding off. I think that's a great idea. Closing the boxes when placed into storage racks. Adding, uh, placing computers into the storage. That's a great idea, actually. Increased box throwing force. Lovely. So there's some new little thingies in the update that sound great. But we'll see. Um, we'll see as we play. Back in our lovely little world. I have storage stuff. I still don't love the setup of this, but, you know, it is what it is right now. Oh, okay, so it tells you how many... What? Can't remove the label when there is product. Okay, I don't understand what that means exactly. So it tells me how many there is. That's pretty good. I like that. This is my chicken box, I guess. Mm-hmm. 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 I see, I see, I see. Um Okay, so we need to go through our storage area and fill things back up and then I don't know what to do I guess I could expand the store more I can I can I don't know I don't know where to go with this either I take out ridiculous amounts of loans that like I can't keep up with so that I can do some crazy shit or I continue this really slow burn of a game both sound fun to me in different ways so I'm not entirely sure what I want to do. Like it would be it would be really dis destructive to like just, you know, start playing a completely different way than I had initially, I guess. Would I rather have a delicious piece of gum or experience the most traumatic life-changing event? That would reshape my very future. Um, I feel like I've had enough traumatic events that have reshaped my future, so like, I'll take the gum, to be honest. Sometimes you gotta say enough is enough and just eat some gum instead.
God, I have so much tuna. No one wants to buy this junk. No one even likes tuna. This fucking ice cream ass pasty looking tuna. Gross. If I keep fucking going through the wrong door. I mean... I mean, listen, if you were like... If you were not sure of your life, I could understand being like, you know what, I need a big change. I need a big time change that'll force me to change. I get it. Um, but... Gum is cool. I love gum. Where did I put bread? Wait, shouldn't there be a sticker? No. No? No, no, no. Okay. Oh no, it's over here. There we go. I think I had bread somewhere. Uh, my bleach is all full. Whoops. Sorry about that, buddy. More salt can go out for sure. I can't wait until they add more, uh, customization options because honestly, these walls, I'm not fucking with them. Like, not even a little bit. Um, so I hope to change that at some point in the future. Um, oh yeah, let's get a fortune. Oh, would you look at that? See, no need for traumatic events. I know my tea is all full. Okay, I'm gonna need that peanut butter. Stop! Hate when they run over my products. They're gonna be real mad when they're the one to get it later. You get the spoiled milk, sir. I remember your license plate number, don't you worry about it. I should read what uh, positioning got changed because they said something about like the way certain things were laid out got changed. Where's my coffee shelf? I guess it'll be here. This was the potato shelf. Where's my coffee shelf? I have tea. Do I not have coffee? Uh, I guess coffee can go here. No, this is where the red flower goes. What the fuck? What the fuck? Where's my coffee shelf? gonna be here. <laughs> I guess. Fuck up. Cheese. Cheese. Do I not have a shelf for cheese anymore? What have I been doing in this store? What's happening? I really- the, the whole change just- like, it just- Screwed me up, apparently. Uh oh. Are you getting tricked today? Here's a trick. Uh, subscribe to me for really good content uh, that will be available to you on a regular basis. Okay, so I cleared the shelf. Do I just click the- okay, that get rid of it, okay. Okay. I'm 
I only needed one thing of oil. Damn. There we go. Okay, so we still need peanut butter, this, one of these, one of those, one of these guys is probably one of all of these. Definitely no more yogurt. Oh yeah, too much yogurt. Regular is subjective. Well, you know, I've been thinking about like stuff that I can do or like upload that would be interesting, but then like. You know? <laughs> you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Without saying, you know what I'm saying? I didn't need that much olive oil, I guess. It's okay. Everybody loves olive oil. I don't know how olive oil became like the default cooking oil for some people, but like here we have vegetable oil. It's just, it's just like so much better sometimes. And cheaper. We'll have like a little hot take about olive oil. I don't think it's that tasty. Like when I heard that like Starbucks was making that one coffee drink with putting olive oil in it, I was like, I would gag and die. I would think somebody was pulling a prank on me. Like, what do you mean? Like, I can understand it. Didn't I order juice? I guess not. Um. Like, I understand it conceptually, in places where it should go. You know what I'm saying? Like, I get it. I get it. But also... Love your content regardless. Also, olive oil coffee made people shit themselves, if I remember correctly. Right. Right? This pasta goes in here. I guess. I don't know. My shoulders are all fucked up and it's actually making me upset. <laughs> I don't like what's happening in my store right now. Well, okay. Okay, okay, hold on. I'm gonna make a case for butter coffee. I've never had it, but I'm gonna make a case for it. Just give me one sec, okay? The case is, is that butter is basically cream, right? It's weird. I'm gonna say it's weird, but it's essentially, it is a milk-based product, which we put into stuff all the time. You know what I mean? So, like, while it is still extremely disgusting to me, and I would never do it myself, I feel like I can kind of follow the logic a little bit better. You know? But like, but like olive oil, like I've had like, you know when you go to a, like an Italian restaurant and they like give you like bread with olive oil and some spices, I'm like, I don't, I don't really even want the olive oil. Like, like I don't want that there. It like never, it's not a very good vehicle for the spices. And I'm just like, I don't know, I'm just not- I'm just not a huge fan. I'm not a fan in the way that a lot of people are about it. My box room is terrible. My box room? Storage room. Oh, I have too much orange juice. Okay, I need more water. Whatever. Um, oh, for fuck's sake. 
Listen, I made this display so that it would be easy to restock. I know it's just giving me trouble. Um... Did I get all that cereal? I don't think so. No. So I need this cereal. I already full on fresh fries. The potato bag. The chicken. Um, I needed more of that shelf milk. This cleaner. Shelf milk and water. Where's the water? Okay, there it is. That's good. Oh, whoa! Okay. I mean, great. I'm sure no one will run it over. You can close the boxes by pressing B, B, or I. Okay. I'll. B. B. V. B. V. I? I. It doesn't do any of it. <laughs> it doesn't do any of it. Oh, C. C is the button. It was on the screen. Um. No, oh, I hate that. I hate sneezing. <sighs> oh, I shouldn't have opened that. You know what? It's fine. Whatever. I'm mad at my store right now. It looks like ass. You need to expand it. I'm like... I had such a specific view for it, and then everything changed because it expanded in a way that I didn't expect it to. I feel like I should have more control over that, but it's fine. Okay. These fucking potato bags. They're so big. People are gonna be like, we need more potatoes! All day. We demand potatoes. Okay. Um. I guess this is pretty full. It's not entirely full. But. I'm pissed. <laughs> so. I'm gonna just. You know what, I'm gonna buy the chocolate because it's necessary. Um, and then we're gonna just go through a day and hopefully I'll feel more motivated once, you know, things are going. Um, what are the prices? Let's see. I wish there was like a tab that I just showed you like what went up in price. Um, The cereal. This guy. That's still a good price for it. Okay. I'm open! I'm ready, I think. I'm just gonna stand right here. I just hate sneezing because it's like. It's like, oh, I'm sick. I just always feel like I'm sick all the time, and I just want to be healthy. I just want to be healthy! I'm changing my store into a health food store, that's it. Ma'am, please buy everything. I'm gonna close my store now because it looks ugly. <laughs> Could you imagine? I'm not gonna lie. That is kind of my vibe, though. Like, my store's too ugly. I don't want to have it anymore. This is why I can never become, like, a like a legit business owner. Oh, but, like, the wallpaper doesn't look like how I imagined. I'm gonna cancel. How, how do I cancel my business? Hello, ma'am. How are you today? 
hope you're doing well. I'm okay, I guess. You don't care. Bye. <laughs> just, just the six pack of milk for the gentleman today. All right. Have a good day. This really does feel like when I used to work retail, when you just feel like absolute dick. But you just gotta. Oh my god. You just gotta. Hello. Have a good day. Took all my toilet paper. These people don't deserve it. They don't know me. They don't know my life. And what I'm going through and how I feel. Yeah. They're just... Everyday people just doing their shopping. You know what the hardest part of streaming this game is? Is finding a, like, royalty-free background music, which is- this isn't. But it's as good as I could do. Three chickens! Three whole chickens! Sorry. Have a good day. Look at her beautiful summery dress. I love that. He bought the tuna. I was wondering when anyone would buy any of it. He's like the first guy. Sick. All right. Do I need to? I need to buy more chicken. I don't have any chicken. People are gonna get mad. Chicken. Don't worry, guys. Chicken delivery is here. You get your chicken and your french fries at the same time. Can you believe it? Probably gonna need more, but I'm just gonna get more potatoes, sir. See, this is why, like, like they're really like doing good things for this game by giving you like restockers and like other cashiers and stuff. And like, I love that, but also like. The unnecessary stress that I put upon myself in this game is kind of what makes it super fun. So, like, while I do want to buy, you know, like, the restockers and the employees, I'm just, like, just having a good time. <laughs> like, managing everything myself. Oh, I didn't buy it. Thank you for following! Oh hell, I gotta fill my potatoes. Oh, that's already full. Holy shit. Oh, someone bought more potatoes. Hi! How are you, ma'am? Thank you so much. Hey, girl, hey. Hello? I am here. Thank you for coming. That guy- this guy handed me his card backwards. What's wrong with him? No one else has done that so far. See? Forward facing card. What is he? Was he a spy or some shit? I don't trust that guy now. I'll never trust him ever again. I'm still hoping that they'll add in some, like, weirdo characters that would make me happy. I just want a little alien to show up, and I want him to be, like, four feet tall and green with antenna. It'd be so cute. <laughs> no moxins in store. I mean, yes, that would be lovely. 
I would like just anything out of the ordinary to appear. Because you know what? It's a video game. And as much as this is like quite literally exactly like working as a cashier, um, it is a video game. <laughs> There should still be something going on, you know, that's a little bit for the ha-has, you know. A vampire, you have to let- well, the, the store says open, so it's basically a welcome mat. You're basically welcome, welcoming vampires into your thing. You know, that's so funny. That's why people, like, um, some people who are, like, really, really- like, they really believe in that type of shit. They, like, they won't have, like, doormats that say welcome, or they won't have any signs that say welcome because they believe it's, like... Ooh, no. Sorry. Um, they believe it's, like, welcoming spirits or demons into your house. Oh, that's, like... That's so funny to me. I want to live in a world where, like, demons exist. That'd be sick. Yeah, that, that's why, like, they warn you against not having a doormat that says welcome, or having, like, any signs by your door that says welcome, because you're inviting... You're inviting bad spirits into your home. Well, I mean, outside of vampires. <laughs> I just mean, like, spirits in general. Alright, nobody complained about my store today. That was nice. If a vampire sees the welcome at, it is welcoming you. You're welcoming people or things into your home, so, like, yeah. Do I have chicken outside? No. I do. It's potatoes. <laughs> it's not chicken, it's potatoes, it's safe. Um. I thought it was chicken by how big the box was, but... Silly me. You know, I often think about- oh, um, before I get into that. Look at that! And I made a profit today? That shit's crazy. Cereal went down, the olive oil went up. Olive oil. Six nine nine. Cereal. It literally changed the price yesterday. It's fine! Four ninety nine. What I was gonna say was, I wish I was, like, delusional into believing, like... Okay, hold on. Warning. If you believe in religious stuff, that's cool. But you might not like what I have to say. <laughs> um... I wish I was delusional enough to believe in that type of stuff, because it sounds fun. You know? Like, these people, like, genuinely believe in, like, some type of magic and shit, you know? Um... Like, when you think about, like, Jesus and stuff, like, Jesus is a magician performing magic tricks. And people are like, oh my god, that's so cool. And they, like, believe that he's gonna, like, come back. And then, like, the devil, like, the literal, like, actual, like, demon devil exists. Like, that's so cool. That's so hardcore. And I'm just like, no, well, no. <laughs> you know? Damn, nobody wanted tea. That's crazy. The British are crying. I'm gonna reorganize this, because this is psychotic. What I have going on here is fucking crazy. Um... Well, that's the thing. It's like... Like, okay. Uh, despite my Twitch tags, I don't believe in, like, witchcraft either. I think it's, like, fun. You know, I think it's fun. I think if it helps, this is how also I feel about religion, if it helps people get through whatever they need to get through, that's great. You know what I mean? As long as they're not doing anything to anybody else. I don't really care what you do. 
Um, but like, magic isn't real. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You lighting a candle and saying some words three times into the candle isn't doing anything for anybody. It's doing something for you, which is fine. But it's the same thing, like, you praying isn't doing anything for anybody. But they, like, j they, like, believe it so hard, and I just, I think that's so wonderful. And I really hope, for their sake, that, like, it is real. And that would be so, like, honestly, as someone who doesn't believe in that shit, that'd be so sick for me. I'd be like, holy fuck, you guys were right the whole time. That's fucking crazy. You know what I mean? I'd be so pumped. I would be so pumped if it turned out to be true. I'd be like, holy shit, that's fucking nuts. There is actually a demon guy, and people like fucking evaporated and went to heaven. Like, that shit's crazy. That's fucking crazy. You know what I mean? I'm just saying to be cool as fuck. But unfortunately, everybody who believes in this stuff really really believes that they're the special ones and that whatever major event is going to happen during their lifetime and it's been going on since the beginning of time so it's kind of like i don't know i kind of feel like maybe i feel like maybe it's not gonna happen because it's like not real but like i don't know <laughs> that's just my opinion um Make you pray? I'll be like, dear lord, get this motherfucker out of my face before I slap the shit out of him. That's exactly what I would have said. And then, you know what? Whatever happens from there happens. <laughs> no. I'm willing to take the repercussions for that type of talk, honestly. Yeah, um, I once had a friend who was like super religious and they tried really hard to get me to see the light and like save me and I was like, okay, no, but thank you, but no, <laughs> but thank you, but also no. I'm reasonable. You know. I get it, you're sad that I'm gonna burn in hell, but also... Not. Probably not gonna happen. Just because it's not real, but... But, but thank you! I think that's sweet, thank you. But also, no. I don't know why I took that off. Dope. Okay. I'm getting my boxes back in order now. We can feel better about the storage. Oh, I can feel better about the storage area. You know what I do wish, though? This would be a good quality of life update. We just move the sticker of the item onto the sides of the box. So that you can reference them m more easily, but... It's not that important. But, you know, all of these boxes are the same. It's hard to differentiate. I keep opening them. Yeah, I'll... I'll... I'm not- I'm not in love with my store enough quite yet to go, uh, fully crazy and, like, um, you know. Also, see, it's, like, a little glitched out, so I can't really- I can't re it's all a mystery. I shouldn't be closing these boxes, because I'll never know what's in them now. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna leave them open for now, because... My game's a little glitchy. I can't see what's inside or what's on the sticker anyway. Um, 
But yeah, I just think it's like really fun that religious people get to have such a good time, you know? They're out there like believing demons are real. And that like Satan's real. Like I think that's neat for them. I think it's really cool to live in like a fantasy land. I can't. I I can't live in that fantasy land, so Yeah. Oh yeah, this butter's been sitting out here for days. Okay. Storage racks have outwardly facing. Oh, okay, that's good. Is that why? So like the update did that? I'm assuming. Oh god, a box of sugar. Somebody could have stolen that from me. You know, not my open door fucking storage area though. Explain Santa? Shit. I mean, you got me there. Alright. I don't really know what I need. I need some of this soda though. Let's just get some soda, some toilet paper, um, some chicken. <laughs> I don't fucking know! Everything's all over the place! I feel all over the place. This is a bad day. This is a bad work day for me. Honestly. Okay, I think I need more milk. Um. We did make a profit, so like that's nice. A couple days of profit so that I can expand the store again will be nice. And, like maybe fix the way that it looks. I should have thrown away all those boxes. I'm gonna need them when I gotta move stuff around. So, here. Mmm, green soda. just need mm, some coffee and then I'm gonna open the store. I know I don't have a lot in stock right now and I'm not fully stocking everything but that's because I'm gonna be making some changes after this day. So. Whatever profit I can make, I can make. Okay, let's go. Open, 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 open. Open! Uh, damn it. Call in sick to your own star. I really should. You would want to be the demon lady. It's probably not as sick as you think it is, to be honest. I, yeah, I'll get some toilet paper too. Oh, it's like a phantom one. Hello, sir. How are you today? Bye, Gaga. Thank you for following. I just... It's just ugly. My store is just ugly and that makes me sad. I don't want my store to be ugly. You know? And it, like... When you have to work at an ugly store, does it make you feel good? Like, have you ever shopped at like a TJ Maxx? You kind of want to die. You know what I'm saying? 
And that's how I feel. This is where I feel like I am right now. TJ Maxx. The honeys with the potatoes. Nothing makes sense. You go into a TJ Maxx, there's like clothes and then like weird shelf-stable food off to the side. And you're like, who would eat any of this? And I still want to know who's eating any of it. Who's going to TJ Maxx to do some grocery shopping? I think I've been to Ross once. That's like a... Um, I think I went with my sister in California. If I'm correct, it's only like... Jesus, she bought like all of the toilet paper! Um, maybe she's got a TP a house or something. I don't know. God. I think I went there once... Um, when I was in California with my sister, and I was like for to look for a Halloween costume, which I didn't find. But I did find a really sick jacket that I would be able to use for a costume in the future if I ever decided to do that costume. Um, I was trying to find all of the elements for like a like the um, uh, Bride of Chucky, like Tiffany, her wedding dress costume. And I found literally the most perfect, like, motorcycle jacket. And it was cheap as fuck, but it looks exactly the same. And it was $13, and I was like, I just have to buy it. Like, <laughs> I just have to buy it and keep it. Because, like, maybe one day. Maybe one day I'll use it for that. But it was, like, so perfect, and I was like, for that amount of money, I'm gonna- Oops. Uh, absolutely not. Um... I'm gonna buy this and keep it, just in case. Show us? Oh, it's in my room. I don't wanna go get it. <laughs> I don't want to. And like, I'm wearing a sweater, so it look like shit. Anyway. But like, because I, I was searching for one in general and when you search for like motorcycle jacket online even on like the cheapest websites they are so expensive and like to use as a costume you know what i mean like i was like i don't really want to i don't really want to be spending that much money you know like a costume piece so when i went with my sister she was like you have to get that and i was like you're right I was like literally debating it. I was like, I don't need this. She's like, just get it, idiot. And I'm glad I did because I do love it. I'm glad that I have it in case. She's mad about the cheese. Whatever, ma'am. I'm going through some stuff right now. We can all just have cheese all the time. Or coffee. They're gonna start complaining. I didn't fully stock my shelves. Whatever. That guy loves mozzarella cheese. My finger kind of hurts from clicking so much. <laughs> I'm such a weak gamer. I can't be clicking this much in my life. Ugh, arthritis in my finger. Is it possible to get... Well, I guess anything is possible. Just, like, have one arthritic finger. I know. I Listen, I love cheese and coffee, too. I just... You just can't... You just can't have it all day, every day. Sorry, sir, about your flower! Oh my god. There's two hours to close and I have nothing on my shelves. Y'all better buy other stuff instead. But my feeling, so as I was saying, 
about this, uh, about this feeling like a TJ Maxx. Is like when I go into a store, because I'm not <laughs> nice. Um, when I go into a store that's like particularly messy, I feel like I need to clean it. It drives me fucking crazy. And I and I think and I think it's just because I've worked retail for so long that like I f I feel like I need to do that. But like it. It just, it so genuinely bothers me. Like, I don't, I do not understand how people, like, can work in a store that looks like shit. You know what I mean? I'm just like, like, I can't, did he hand me money and I just took it without realizing it? Um. Any store. If I go into any store and it looks disheveled, I'm like, I have to clean, I have to fix it. Oh, dude, do you know how many times I've wanted to, like, actually help people at a dollar store? <laughs> like, it looks like fucking shit, but it doesn't need to! I love the dollar store. I wanted to work there. I still kind of do. But it's because I'm sitting there like, I could... I could help them, you know what I mean? Like, I could fix this. I could fix this problem. I know what's happening and I could fix the problem. So, like... It's not really the most realistic way of going about things. Um, ooh, a lot of people complain. But I made a thousand dollars today, so... Doesn't matter. Oh, I didn't pay, like, any of my bills. Oh! Frick. Uh-oh. I, for I forgot about- I forgot about all that. That's right. He's got- Oh, shh. Don't worry, it's an investment. Often it's just one employee. Yeah, that's the- that's really the sad state of retail right now. I feel like I feel like if you want to work retail, you have to like work at a grocery store or something. Cuz like grocery stores are never going out of style, you know what I mean? That shit needs to get out on the shelf. Everybody needs to eat. You got to you just people need to work there in order for it to function really well. Yeah. I mean, even when I worked at Arts and Crafts store, it was like... We would only have a couple people, unless it was a truck day, in which case then like everyone would be there, but... If it was a truck day, or if it was Black Friday, or Christmas, those were the only times you had people in the store, really. Oh! That's thank you, but no thank you. Um... All right, let's um, get a bigger store. God, that's so much money, though. Ugh. Oh, would you look at that? Okay, this is better. It's a big square, and I feel good about it. Let's just move some of these things now. Okay, um, we have another fridge over here. I feel like I need to get rid of this small one. I don't know what to do with it. No, I still don't have a plan. <laughs> but I feel better. I feel better about this. I feel better about this space now. Regular store is good despite what people tell. I, I'm pro retail. I've I've done a lot of retail. I like it. I will never tell someone that it's not a good job. 
I'll tell people that it's like a fairly easy job that has some bits that are a little stressful. Especially like if you did work in a place like I did where, you know, you would only have one person on staff. Like, yeah, no, I agree. That's not a great environment to work in. Um, how do I want to set this up? I need to move these free freezers. When I think about aisles, at a grocery store it's usually like it's usually like fridges back to back right back to back and then maybe in the middle there would be like an aisle of freezers or it's at the very end of the aisle of the refrigerators it is a low stakes job this is this this whole game has basically just been me telling people, like, go work retail. <laughs> it's not that bad. It's fine, actually. Um, can I? Hold on. Where do all my products go? They're still on the shelf. That is so wonderful. Okay. I... I mean, can I just drop that? Thank you. I thought like, okay. I thought maybe like, um, it would all just like scatter on the fucking floor or something. So I'm glad that that's not happening. I can sell it? How much... Sell hold. Do I... Well, I don't want to sell anything, I don't... Well... If that'll clear my shelf and I can just buy my shelves again... I don't know, maybe. Um... Okay. So, do I make my aisles... I think I need to make my aisles go a long ways, right? This is the most length I have. And do I have like freezer or fridges? Fridges, fridges, freezers? Freezer in the middle and then like just regular shelves over here because that's fine if there's regular shelves over there. Let's see. Let's just see how this will work and look. This guy, I don't know what to do with this guy. I want to be able to fit three of them next to each other. Is that possible with those? Is it possible? Is it possible? It's not possible. Why is it not possible? Why? Why? What is this fucking wall ruining my life for? I guess it doesn't really matter. It's just a window. Who needs to see outside? You know what I'm saying? Right? Right? See, now this would be a good thing for customization. You can customize the window, you can put like little stickers that say like 50% off and then not have a 50% off sale. Um, but it would be nice to like put stuff there um okay so then freezer freezers like do i want one row of freezers let's just see what one row looks like freezers aren't the same size as the refrigerators that is quite annoying to me. Um, hmm. I don't like that. I don't like that. I'm very upset by that, actually. Um, 
See, because, like, when I'm thinking grocery store, right? So, like, you have your aisles of freezers or whatever. And then you have, like, this. Right? You have, like, this. Right? And then, like, and then, like, on this side, you would have, like, more freezer- more fridges. You would have more refrigerators going this way. And then you would have, like, an aisle of shit. Mm. Or, what I said, the alternative was, like, this kind of vibe. But that looks like ass. Like... I don't like that they- they're all- they look so different. I don't like that. I don't like it. I don't- I don't like it. I think I'm just gonna have to live with this. I think, though, I can squeeze the knit in a little bit tighter. Because hear me out, okay? If I have to get more freezers... If I have to get more freezers, I'm gonna put them back to back. So it's like one big fat aisle. Um... Right now, I want the illusion of, like, a cohesive aisle. That's pretty equal. And then, if I get... I'll get... Uh... This guy, I still don't know what the fuck to do with this guy. Wait, he's a lost cause, but maybe he's perfect. <gasps> maybe it's perfect. No, it won't be perfect. It's fine. <laughs> I'm not annoyed, it's fine! Um, we're gonna get another fridge. Uh, which is, uh, <laughs> uh, there it is. Okay, great. Right. Now this is uneven because this guy's here. No. You know? You know, I don't love it. But it's okay. We'll get another small fridge. <laughs> I can sell them. Now that I know that I can sell them, it's fine. It's fine. I like my little aisle until this fucking doesn't line up and it's gonna piss me off. It's gonna piss me the fuck off. Okay. Uh, um. Yeah, it doesn't really line up. It doesn't really line up. Hey, but like, what if we just space this out a little bit better then? Right there. No one needs to see this back corner, it's fine. And then... These aisles are like so tight and I hate that. But I think it's gonna work out the way that I want it to look. Ah! Okay, it's fine. Maybe it'll work out? Is this too close? That's way too close. They're not gonna fit. Maybe they will fit next to each other. They're not gonna fit next to each other. Such. Hold on. We'll figure this out. Oh, that's too much space! It's too much space. Oh god damn it. Okay, hold on. Okay, okay, wait. Are these as close as they can be? They're not. Okay, I'm sorry everybody. You're gonna be bumping into each other until I get an even bigger store. Just thank you. Who's gonna shop here? Look at this aisle! I can't fit in here! There's no way. If I can't fit in here, how do my customers fit in there? 
That's awful. I can't do that to them. I gotta give them a little bit more room. Hold on. Oak, 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 okay. It's okay. Alright, hold on. Right? Okay, so you can still walk through. Uh, but then, let's see, hold on now. If I do this, right about there. I mean, so I can, like, move this guy over. And then I can move this guy over. Ah! I had it perfect, god damn it. Get in there. Please? Okay. And then now this guy can fit, right? See, look at this. Okay, look. I got it. I can now I can make now I can make even more minute adjustments to make the shopping experience better for everyone. Okay. <laughs> we need a better angle on that. Uh Why? Why? What is causing the issue here? This guy? Get out of here. Get the fuck out of here. See, this is- this is better. This- like, you got- it's like you got air to breathe now. It's fine. They can open the doors! Listen, that's what the game says. They have space to do. I'm allowing them all the space that they need. And more! Look at that! And more! Look at that! That looks good! I don't care who you are. Oh shit, I forgot about that bridge. Oops. I hate that my f my fridges are uneven and stuff, but like it's fine, I guess. Like that looks see look that looks like a nice aisle. I wish these were the same size so that they could all line up nice and perfect, but that's never gonna happen. Oh Look at this. Oh I love when shit lines up. It's like my favorite thing in the world. Like genuinely. If I see things and they're like uneven, I just get like, I'm just like, this is disgusting. It looks like shit. It looks terrible. And the moment it lines up with another thing, I'm like, beautiful, amazing, it's gorgeous, it's the best thing I've ever seen in my life. Uh, yeah. Uh, perfect. See, look at that. And I could get more aisles. And, the, and and see, I could get an aisle and I can make it go from here, and I can get more aisles make it go from here, and I can get more aisles make it go from here. See, look at this. Oh my god, it looks so much better! Oh, I'm so happy. Okay, sick. That looks cute. Thank you! I- listen, this is what a real grocery store looks like. They have fridge aisles and the freezers. Listen, whatever. I know some of y'all didn't trust the process, but you should have trusted the process. Um, what is this? Checkout counter mirrored. Oh, so it's just like opposite. Why would I want that? So that I'd face this way? Well, I guess if you had multiple registers, I guess that would make sense. Um, Okay, do we buy? Do we buy more regular shelves? I don't really know what to do right now. I have to like move all this stuff. 
I don't think I have enough boxes to move everything. So we'll see. Can I get the water back? I can. Okay, great. Start with... This is gonna be drinks! Wait, hold on. I'm walking in the store. I wanna buy a soda. It's gonna be on the left. Okay, that's not gonna work out for me right now because there's too much stuff. Well, I guess I could move the whole fridge. I'm so stupid. Why does anybody let me talk? Or do anything? Honestly. Um, okay. Sorry. I know I perfected it and now I have to move everything around, but it's necessary. Um, that's soda fridge. Soda fridge, soda fridge. Okay. So we'll have water, orange juice, apple juice. Is there any other drink? I don't think so. But that's fine. All we need to do is take the eggs out of there. And the yogurt. So let's get a box for the gurt. Which I think it fits in this one. Where's the gurt? There it is. Damn it! There's one gurt left. Oh, yeah, one. I do have boxes for this. Ooh, I have a headache. Ooh, it hurts. Oh! Okay. That was not pleasant. Um. I do want to move the water where it is, though. I've been dealing with, like, really bad headaches the last, like, couple weeks. I sure hope I don't have a tumor. That would suck. Okay, water, juices, and then sodas. I like that. I like that order of stuff. Is it oh my god, and there's milk! Oh shit, I forgot about milk. Water, orange juice, apple juice, milk, sodas. Okay, we're good. You guys ever get paranoid about stuff like that? You're like, what if... What if I just have a brain tumor and I don't know? That's not what we should be talking about here, sorry. <laughs> I don't mean to set off anybody's paranoia about that stuff. Um... Yeah, but... Wait, there's something in here? What's in here? Oh, a girt. Can I get this out, though? Okay, and now I can put my milk there. Get this off of here. Oh no. I have big paranoia about teeth stuff, but will I ever see a dentist? I need more water, more juice, more- I need more- do I have any of this stuff? I think I do. I know I have water. I think I have juice? I do. I have so much fucking orange juice. Is there more in there? There so is. Okay. So, when we buy juice, we just need apple juice. Let's get these sorted right away so that I don't have to fucking think about them anymore. Okay, we need some apple juice, we need a little bit of milk, and all the sodas. Oops. I love that it shows my, my in input movements because I had a typing thing there. Okay, apple juice. And then the sodas are like at the bottom. Soda, 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 soda. 
Um, Diet Dr. Pepper has always been the shit. Oh, I'm sure the Zero version is just as good, but like... Even when I wasn't like intentionally drinking those things, if I- oops, I shouldn't have gone that way. If I got like a like a diet Dr. Pepper by accident, like I wouldn't be mad about it. You know like if you go to like a store or if you go to like a drive drive through fast food fast food maybe I maybe I do have a brain tumor. Why am I talking like this? Um <laughs> when you go like to a fast food place and they're like they give you the diet by accident. Like Diet Coke is so different than regular Coke. It's no good. Um but if I ever got like a like a diet Dr. Pepper it should taste the same. It's not about the sugar in that case, and it never was. Um, okay, I need more green soda and more milk and more orange juice. I want to be fully stocked. Which soda do I need? The green one? That's it? Yeah, I just need the green one and some milk. Um, mm -mm -mm -mm. Wait, did I need apple juice? Why not? Why not get it anyway? Why not spend my money anyway? Fine. Oh, this is so... Oh my god, like... I'm so happy! This looks great. I love spend money. Me too, Frosty. Hi, how are you? It's not fully stocked. That is depressing. I'm gonna need to get one more. I should just... Uh... Fridge. There we go. Because I'm doing all my fridges right now. I'm not gonna have money for, like, literally any other products on the shelf because I just spent so much money on this shit. Fine. Okay, root beer. I don't know. I don't know how I, feel. I haven't had root beer in so, so long. I should probably give it another shot. You know? Um, it would probably be a good thing for me to do as just like a human being, you know? Like to just try it again. But I remember absolutely fucking hating it, so... You know? Okay. Coming into the market, I need eggs. They gotta be right here. They gotta be right here. The eggs they just have to be right there. Um... Let's get... What do we need? Eggs? Well, we could get the eggs, the 8-pack and the 4-pack. For like full shelves. So if I get those and I get these. I guess depending. I don't think they're gonna I don't think they're gonna need that much shelf space. The okay. I see my mistake. You guys don't need to say it to me. I already know what's happening. It's fine. Smaller amount should go on top, is basically what I was saying here. Oh my god. Um, I feel like people will probably want more and more eggs. So I'm gonna get the big eggs. I'm gonna get more big eggs. Um... Oops. It's fine. Early stream today? Is it early? I feel like it was my usual start time, around 5-ish. Okay, we got eggs. Sick. Next to the eggs, I want butter. Is this box with the butter? You know what I fuck with and I haven't had in a long time? Iced tea. I'm 
Do I want like a whole shelf of butter? Well, I don't really know what else goes in a fridge. Hold on. What else do we got? We've got cheese. We've got yogurt. We've got mozzarella. Okay, we need all our cheeses. So, should I do full things of cheese? How many spaces do I have? <laughs> how many spaces and how many products? Uh, four. I have five shelves. If I want to do full top to bottom. So let's see. That would be one shelf. Two shelf, three shelf. And then I would need two more shelves. For yogurt. And tuna. This is genius, if you ask me. Let's get our cheese shelves going. Um, I feel like... This is like fancy cheese, you know? Is this guy going yes. So we got our Parmigiano Reggiano. We got our mozzarella, and we're just gonna have our regular fucking whatever ass cheese it is. What cheese is this? Hot Comte cheese. I don't know what cheese that is. But the people love it, so. Okay, so we need more butter and way more cheese. More butter and way more cheese. Cheese, cheese. Cheese, 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 cheese. Butter. <laughs> oh, I'm not gonna have money by the end of this. But it's fine, it's gonna look beautiful and I'm gonna be happy. Holy fuck, how much butter can go out there? Yo, if anybody ever needs butter, I got it. Are you guys excited? Pedestrians, human beings, look at all this, look at all this butter I have. Look at all this butter I, you wouldn't believe how much butter is in this store. What's a good iced tea to start on? Well, like, I haven't had, like, I like... I like an Arizona iced tea. I just haven't had one in so long. Do they make, like, a sugar-free version of it? I think that's why I haven't had it in a while, because, like, I... Listen, I like to eat too much, and I refuse to, like, I refuse to have 500 calories worth of, like, a drink when I can eat food. So, if there's not, like, a diet version or a sugar-free version, I just won't have it anymore. The other day I had a, uh, I had a Verner's, which if you know, you know. Um... I need more butter and more cheeses, oh my god. Um, and like, it was not diet, it was just regular, and it was like, delicious, but I was like... It's evil. It's like, like it's so good, and I, like, I can't... I cannot be having this all the time. Like, I just simply can't. If you've never had a Verner's, if you like ginger ale and you've never had a Verner's, I'm so sorry for you. They're so fucking good. Okay, we still need more cheese. I can't believe how much cheese we need. That's crazy. I better be making so much money after this! I'm not. I'm gonna be in debt my fucking eyeballs until I die. Okay. So we've got butter, cheeses, and then I would say... And then I would say yogurt. Yogurt tuna. Right? Because that's all that I can put that I don't have already. Yogurt tuna. Yogurt tuna. 
running out of money. Do 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 do, it's so sad. What box did the fucking eggs come in? Did I throw them all away? I thought it was a small one. Oh. Uh. Yogurt. Those eggs don't fit. What, what size bo is it? This one? It is. Okay. Okay, and then tune all the way down. Right. Need to buy this box of yogurt. Well, maybe I did because I have four shelves to fill it. Oh, they did. Oh, they changed it so it stacks on top of each other. Oh, I love it. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to buy so much fucking yogurt. <laughs> Shit. God damn. God damn it. Okay, hold on. what else did I have in here? I know I had tuna in here. Did I not? Is that this guy? Oh. Is that this guy? Yeah. Did I have yogurt in here? I can't tell. The boxes are all glitched. <gasps> I had cheese in here! Wait, do I need to fill it? I totally forgot that I had fucking overstock. Um... Okay. It's okay. Uh right. We need so much yogurt. We need three boxes of yogurt. I'm gonna have to take out a loan. That sucks. Cause I have to fill all of the other shelves and maybe buy more shelves. That's okay. It's okay. We'll make up the money. What if I just went crazy and, like, I just want to, like, overprice everything just for a day, just to see what people do? It won't. I can't believe yogurt is sending me into debt. That's crazy. But, like, look how beautiful it looks. But, like, look how beautiful my shelves look. Look at it. Look at this place. Look at this fucking place, dude! Oh my god. A dream come true. Okay. We need chicken. <laughs> um... So, my freezer. We need two of these chicken guys. And then that'll be done with that aisle. I still think the chickens should be able to stack on each other, but okay. <sighs> okay. That was a lot of work. We'll just leave that tuna in the hot sun. It's fine. Okay. My refrigerator aisles are done. They're beautiful. They're gorgeous. I am in love. I am truly in love. Um, now let me see... What what changes in price? I don't think I can do that now. Yeah, really can't do that at the moment. Um, it's like work, dog. <laughs> it's like it's like real life work. What can fit in here? What can fit in this box so that I can clear them off and reorganize? Anything else? Anything else? Anything else can fit in here? Cereals. Thank you. Thank you, phone. Hey, man. Listen, if... Listen, some people out there are willing to pay a premium price for premium products that are actually just below average everyday products. 
And who am I to not take their money? And that's what capitalism is all about. I think. Is it not? Have I been taught the wrong lesson about capitalism? Um... Um, actually, my prices are extremely fair. Don't talk shit about my store. I have- I have never overpriced anything. See, like, look. The market price is $20. And the average- I'm only making a profit of $6 on this. And I feel like that is very fair. If you want to fight me on it, I'm not going to listen to you. I'm too busy counting my money. Okay. Please don't talk to me. I don't talk to poor people. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Just kidding, I am the poor people. Give me this box! Okay. Salt? Where'd you go? Salt? 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 Thanks. Ugh, I love reorganize- Ugh. This is so good. <laughs> this is the best gameplay of all time. What else is empty? What can I pick up? Can I pick up any of these guys in here? I can. Damn. Let's get the chocolate. Just wait until I sell alcohol. This town's fucking done for. They're gonna fucking love my shit. That won't be for a while though. I got a I got a big debt to repay. I actually think I had that in storage. I did. Can I fit? Let's see. So good. Um yeah, that'll fit in there. What else we got? More cheese. Did I kill this cheese? We did. This music's so relaxing. I'm gonna fall asleep. Do not fall asleep! Well, actually, you can fall asleep. Watch my stream. That's okay. Just make sure you have it on at full volume. Um, you know. It'll really help. Exactly, viewer retention. I would like people to stay at my streams, that'd be really cool. Uh, but you know what, if you want to? What am I really gonna do about it? Other than cry. It's okay. Damn. Alright. Um, okay. I kind of accomplished some things. I think I want my back wall to be where all the... This is where I want all of the cleaning stuff. Your cleaning supplies, your toilet papers. I feel like that makes sense. I feel like it being in the back of the store makes sense. So, what we need to do is do a little juggling. I'm gonna actually empty some of these boxes. So that I can try to clear off anything else that'll fit. Because I know where I want to go with this one, so... We're just... Filling whatever shelf I can fill at the moment. 
Um, we need a different box for that. Goodie. I don't have a red box. Well, we could start with putting some stuff out. This guy can go here. And then we'll just put this over here for now. Cleaning liquids next to the drinking liquids. That doesn't seem like a very safe idea. So thank you for your suggestion and I truly appreciate it. It really does make this store a better place. I will put your suggestion in the suggestion box where uh, it will probably be burnt and never looked at. Oh, where's that spray stuff? Do I have any of it? I do. It doesn't fit this box. What box does it fit? This one? Sick. Spray stuff could go down here. Well, I feel like actually hand soap should be like at the top. What else do I have for cleaning products? Bleach. Bleach on the bottom. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Listen, I can't app this stores like Aldi's. Aldi's nuts. I have been trying to figure out a way to work Aldi's into a joke like that. And I'm literally so glad that I thank you. Thank you for giving me that opportunity. <laughs> Because I, I have genuinely been thinking about that joke for a week. I was watching GMM and they were doing like a taste test and and the girl said all these and I was like all these nuts and I was like that is so hilarious and perfect and I need to I need to make it happen. I'm sorry I didn't even let the joke simmer for a minute because I was just so excited. <laughs> I was just so excited that it worked. I got it out there. I don't know if anyone's ever made that joke before. They probably have because it's actually like, I think it's pretty good. Um, so feel free to use that <laughs> in your in your life. If Aldi ever comes up casually in conversation, please use that. Okay, what other cleaning products do we have? I gotta get this fucking bread out of here. Does it fit in here? No. I need to order some bread so I can move my bread. I'm so proud of myself right now. Honestly, I just on the stream. You guys may not think it was that much of an accomplishment, but it really, really was. Okay. So we have... Is this fit in here? No. Fuck! What box is this? Alright, I'll get some rice. That's fine. I, you know, like, I, listen, I, I come up with a good joke once in a while. It's so rare, and like, I really, I rarely get W's, so I really gotta, like, hang on to him. I gotta hang on to him when I do get him. Does this guy fit in here? They don't fit in there. Does this guy fit in these? They don't fit in that. What the fuck box does it go in? Uh All right. I'll get some pasta. That's <laughs> fine. Oh. I only have a thousand dollars. I have sixteen hundred dollars, but it feels like a thousand dollars. Thank you. Thank you for being one of the only three people that laughed in the chat. I do appreciate it. Okay, we need these guys. My cleaners. I want them to go, I guess, across. I guess across here. 
And then I need... What else do we have? Bum ba bum ba bum. We have our bleach, we have our cleaners, we have our dishwasher, hand soap, we need toilet paper. So it's basically just toilet paper. Two, four, and like one more of those. I'm running out of money. It's okay. I'll disappear. Get all my toilet paper on there. Like, I guess people don't really care too much about, like, this, this dish tablet stuff, so I guess one row is fine. Even though I literally just want more. Um, and that's pretty full, too. Oh, this store's a mess. Um... So we have all our toilet paper, we have all that. Ooh, maybe I should put the toilet paper- Oh, should I switch these shelves around? I think we gotta switch the shelves around. Just- just- oh. Just stay here for a sec. Instead of trying to move everything, we just move the whole shelf. It's so smart. It's literally so smart. There we go. Okay, that's pretty good. We're gonna need more hand soap and more whatever cleaner. So let's get that squared away. This guy, that guy. You missed it? It was really good. I can't say it again. Cause then it'll be like, uh, that's a pity laugh, and like, I don't... I don't want a pity laugh. Okay, we'll get back to fully stocking that later. These guys, I'm done with. So they can... They can go back in here. Um... Probably gonna need that cereal, actually. No, I don't need water. No, there's water in here. This guy can get boxed up. You can pack a whole shelf too. I know. That's why I was like, that's so fucking handy to be able to move that around. Uh oh yeah, that tune is cooking. That tune is cooking. It's gonna be so good when it's done. It'll be so tasty. Um Damn, I kind of went crazy with the stock, didn't I? Only $1,200 left to fully stock my brand new store. It's going great so far. Um, investment. I gotta spend so much more money. <laughs> I gotta spend so much more money to fix this. Okay. So we have our cleaning aisle. I feel like I don't know what... What should go on the opposite of a cleaning aisle? Usually in a real store, it'll just be like a full aisle of cleaning products. But I don't have enough products to do that quite yet. So... I think we could put like the potatoes, we could put like some potatoes, and I don't know. 
I don't know what the fuck else. Um, cereal? <laughs> cereal aisle, maybe? No. Um, I think the cereal here is fine. Uh... I, why can't I put this box down anywhere? Hello? Am I... Am I just holding the box forever? That was interesting. Um... Uh... Um... I can't drop this box. I can't... I can't put this box anywhere. I can't put this box anywhere! Oh no. Do you think if I save it... Oh no. Do you think if I save it and I close out of it... I'll still be holding the box? Can I toss it? No. I can't. I can't. I can't throw the box. I can't drop the box. Why? I can't drop the box. I can't throw the box. What if, hold on, wait. We haven't tried. What if I just put it back on the shelf? Now can I drop it? Nope. Okay. The box is broken. <laughs> Throw it away? Oh my god. Wait, hold on. Thank you! You guys are so smart. This is what I cultivate. A beautiful, smart community. Let's just take a moment and appreciate what you guys have done. By looking at this wonderful blue sky. That moves, by the way. Look at those clouds. That was nice. That was a nice little break. Okay. <laughs> that was weird, but is that gonna happen? Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, hold on. Okay, hold on. Saved. Is that gonna happen every time I pick up this product? No. Okay, so it was just that box. That box was having a day. Okay, so I still want a cereal aisle. Uh... That box doesn't fit the bread. Um... Okay, this box is broken. Good thing I learned what to do with broken boxes. You know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna restart the game real quick. There's too many... There's too many things happening. You know? Oh, and for uh, those people who tuned into League earlier... I reported that guy that told me to get shot. So... We love to see it happen. Um... Nice. <laughs> we love that. There we go. Hopefully that'll fix this box issue we have. Someone said that? I mean, people say shit in League, but it's like... One person got mad at me because I was playing Ash Mid and I was just not talking. And they spent the whole game, like, talking shit. And then they, like, went into the lobby and they were like... This idiot can't even talk. And I was like... So, like, that's, that's what you wanted. <laughs> you wanted someone to fight with, and I'm sorry, but I'm not your mom. So I'm- I won't be doing that. Um... I 
I just stay quiet and I stay in my lane. Quite literally, it's League of Legends. I mean, I mean, but that is what they want. They want, you know, to have an argument with their mom, you know, who they know loves them unconditionally, even though they're a piece of shit child, you know what I mean? That's what they want. And I'm, I'm not here, I'm not here to give that to you. Okay, we got our cereal. I feel like... Uh, I feel like visually the sugar makes the most sense under the cereal, but... Store-wise, it doesn't make the most sense. You know what I mean? I feel like I need all those baking supplies in one section. So I guess bread can go under there. I don't love it, but it's fine. That doesn't fit. Do I have another one of those? I mean, it's really true. Some people are genuinely just like out there to try to get a reaction. And it's just like, like dude, I'm playing a video game. playing a video game no one's dying you know what I mean like we're just we're all just trying to have a, a normal gaming experience it's okay you can fight about your mom with your mom later about whatever Kyoto pet thank you so much okay well shit Oh, I just had a thought. Oh, I hate thinking. Oh, it sucks. Um. Um. I was like, I can move this over so that I can put like peanut butter and stuff. That makes sense. You know? Oh my god. Which fucking box is it? Okay, it's this one. Sorry. Sorry for reacting. I feel like that sometimes. Um, yeah, I mean, you know, it hurts, I think, but sometimes you do have to use your brain. Uh, there it is. <laughs> I was like, where's my bread box? So we got bread. Bread, bread, peanut butter, honey, like, you know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Maybe two shelves of bread? Comes down to it? Can we need to get the sugar out of the shelf? I think it fits in this box. So we could have, we could have, we could have, we could have two, two sections of bread, right? Two aisle bits of bread, and then we'll have our honey and whatever, and then, uh, I guess I can put the sugar underneath it, I guess. It'll just look nice. It doesn't make the most sense, but it'll just look nice until I get more cereal, you know? But then I have that other sugar- god damn it. Okay, um... <laughs> what? Because I have two sugars now. You know? And I have to put them together because it literally makes sense. Yeah. I don't know, I don't like it. <laughs> I don't know, and I don't like it, okay? I don't know what's happening. I still like my oils. I still like my oils where they are, though, so that's fine. Um... 
Hmm. Hmm. Oil. Pasta? <laughs> Oil, pasta, pasta, rice, pasta, rice, spaghetti. Two flowers, two flowers, two oils. Two flowers, two oils need to be together with sugars. What am I thinking? Honestly, maybe, maybe I do need to get shot. <laughs> maybe I do. You know what? And they're going over here. I've decided. Who knew everything would be so complicated? Nice shot. Okay. Two pastas. Right. Or two oils. Two oils, two sugars. Two sugars, sugars. Sugars. No. Get back over there. Oh god. Sugars. Uh, I need to get that honey off of that shelf. Where's the box? That'll fit it. This one will. Great. Wonderful. Um. Oh, uh. More sugar. Great. Yes, exactly. I really miss Deadly Premonition. I've played it so many times, it's like, I just kind of like want to watch someone else play it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I want to get the satisfaction of playing it again, but like, I don't want to play it again. Um, I've already played it so many times. Um, I think my store is coming along pretty good, actually. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, oil, oils. Oh. Um. Uh. Flower, 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 flower is the next thing we need over here. That makes sense. Pastas can go over here. Oh, it's coming together. It's finally. Finally, it has happened to me right in front of my face. Okay, so we need... We need... We need... We need the flowers. We need flower. We need flower. We need... Oh my god, I have like coffee and tea. And salt. And salt. <laughs> yes. Right. Okay. Um, salt. 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 It's really hard to remember everything. Like, uh, it's it's tough. But you know, like any marketing genius, this is my calling. This is what I was built for. Oh, I know, I know what's, I know what's, what needs to go on the shelves. Okay, salt, salt, sugar, oil, flour. Um. Pasta. Coffee and tea can go. Under the cereal, I guess. Milk. Shelf milk. I forgot about shelf milk. Potatoes! I forgot about the potatoes. <laughs> Oh no. 
I forgot all about the potatoes. Yeah, I'm gonna have to buy more shelves. I only have a thousand dollars left. Oh, um, okay. It's okay. Let's not think about that quite yet. Too much fucking shit in here. Oh. Spaghetti. Spaghetti? Spaghetti's fine here. Um, rice. Box that fits rice is this box. I threw away the box that fits the bread. Okay, no panicking. No panicking. None. This is a relaxing video game. No panicking. How's it going? No. I mean, I'm doing fine. I'm just, you know, there's, there's, like, there's a lot to work out here. There's a lot of logistics, okay? There's a lot more than I bargained for, basically. Uh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Tea. All of the tea, right? All of the tea, all of the coffee. Tea and coffee. Tea and coffee. People love tea and coffee. I don't have any coffee, but it will go there at some point in time. Um. <laughs> Oh my god! Okay. It's fine. Okay. Fully stocked. So beautiful. So happy. Oh my god, there's so much more tea. Okay. There. Oh, the mystery boxes. Oh, that's nice. Um. Guys, this is a lot of work. <laughs> this is a lot of work. And a lot less fun than it was, like, 40 minutes ago. Okay, um... Right. Rice. Um, well, at least these- I mean, okay, hold on. Wait, but just look. Just look. Okay. J just remember- the calming feeling of fully stocked shelves. Okay, this, this is a nightmare, this is a nightmare, I understand. Um... Okay? We're working through it. We're, 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 we have growing pains right now. Um... Fully stocked milk. Uh, exactly. Oh. Okay, potatoes can go here. What else did I need? Potatoes and milk. Oh, but... But then I need a whole shelf for candy. Alright, we're going into debt. That sucks. Shelf for you, shelf. Oh my god. I had... Like four thousand dollars when this game started. Ah! Okay, hold on, I can't. This box is in the way. Get out of here! Move! I need these, but I but I don't need them right now. Okay. Shelf for candy separate from the cleaning products. Well, I mean, 
it's a lot of planning, okay? I think I think once I get to the point where I have like a really huge store, I'm just gonna sell everything. Cause like I'm sitting here trying to rearrange everything. I think the smartest thing would have been would be to have sold everything in the store like boxed it up and sold it and then just buy everything again but i'm dumb and i did not do that so we're working a little bit backwards but it's okay Okay, I think I can get rid of some of these. I think I can get rid of some of them. There's a lot of them. I don't want to get rid of those boxes because I don't necessarily know what can fit in those. I know what can fit in these. I don't need 12 of them laying around. This music's too jazzy. It's too jazzy. I shouldn't have been listening to it. I just started auto playing music, so that's not great, but it's whatever. Um, did I fill all of this oil? I did. Okay, so this is overstock. Well, I mean, a lot of places do do that. They let you... Costco. You know, you just grab a box and you just... Fill it with your shit! Okay, salt was over here. Um... These are overstock eggs. You can go in here. Honey is full? Is full. Uh, the frozen pizzas. <laughs> the frozen pizzas in my totally refrigerated storage area. Cheese. Let me put it down. Here, would you like to take a box, ma'am? Really help me out. What? Here. Let's just see if any of this... Get a nice little ride around town. What else has stuff in it? This does. Increase my odds now. Uh, oh, these are all empty boxes. Great. <laughs> the bitrate keeps fluctuating. I don't know what to do about that. Sometimes on Twitch I see that it's like red, but I have literally no idea why that would be happening. Um. Yeah, I, 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 I understand, but I don't really know why it would do that. I upped my bitrate last time and everyone was like, that looks great. So I'm like, okay, cool. But sometimes Twitch still shows it as red, like in the, uh, in the, like, um, the browser window. So like, I don't know. I don't know why. I would love to know why, but I just... 
Mind you, this is like... I haven't touched any of those settings, like, ever, so... It's all confused, confusing to me. They do not take care of the boxes the way that I would like them to. That's too bad. Okay, so we got milk and potatoes. Who puts potatoes on a shelf? Uh, this game, I guess. Uh, okay. Okay, we're get, we're getting we're getting somewhere. It's almost done. Okay, what do we need for sure? We need coffee. I don't have any coffee. I if I could if I could just Where else would you put potatoes? Potatoes usually go in those giant bins where the gro like the the fresh groceries are. And you just pile them on top of each other. Okay, okay. I'm sorry for littering. I'll fix it. My bad. I'm so glad it's still 8 a.m. That is very reassuring. Okay. We got a coffee. We need more... We need more... I was gonna say green beans. Peanut butter. <laughs> Not green beans. Not even close. Uh, they just... they just get in your way. I mean, I guess you could just kind of throw them all over the city? And then they won't be in your way, but... You know. The game might crash. Our tuna's still cooking out here. No, no, no. Get back in the sun. I want someone to get food poisoning if they ever eat that. Uh Okay. Um That's not the box. I was gonna get more potatoes. But I don't have a milk box now. I don't have a milk box! Son of a bitch. Well, I guess I can still get more potatoes. They just won't look nice. Which was the whole point of rearranging this fucking store. Um... <sighs> okay. Um... Cereal, bread, oils, fill, pasta, coffees, spaghetti, more candy, more potatoes? People love potatoes. I don't like this, but it's what I have to do. <laughs> oh, shit. This was the one. Nope. Yeah, that was the one I needed. I ordered the wrong candy. It's okay. It's fine. Spaghettis. I need the other one, the cake. This guy. God, by the time I open this door, I'm actually gonna wanna go to bed. Um. More cereal. More cereal. That guy and that guy. 
$443? Shit. This was organized, but I'm starting to lose my page. Let's fucking fuck it with spaghetti up there, whatever, man. I'm starting to lose my fucking sh I just want to open my door. Um, this whole shelf is empty. That's it. That's it. I'm done. I'm over it. I need to make money. <laughs> I need to fucking make some money before I lose my mind. My shoulder hurts, my head hurts. Ugh. It's too long and too stressful of a day. It's still 8 a.m. You know what? We'll see where it goes. I I need to make some money. I only have four hundred forty-three dollars. Oh my god, I'm gonna be so sad. Yeah, it's gonna be so sad. I look at my profit. I'm gonna lose so much money. No. Oh my god. At least my store looks okay. It doesn't look okay. It's not perfect. I wanted it to be perfect. It doesn't look anywhere close to perfect because I don't have any money. I don't want to be broke. <laughs> I don't want to be broke. God, that's like me every day of my life. Just screaming at the top of my lungs about how I don't want to be broke. Now what are you gonna do? Sometimes it's just be broke. Here, guys, buy the shit. Oh, I didn't even ch- I didn't even change the prices. The shit went down in price or something. Oh my god, my chocolate bars. Was it just the chocolate that went down in price? No. Shut up. It's chocolate bar. Is it just the chocolate bar? And the oil? Alright, guys. Just hold on a second. You don't understand. Okay, I just wait. I'll be with you in just a second. Oh my god, hand over Fishel, thank you so much. Hello, sir. How are you today? I hope I didn't keep you waiting too long. It's just been a really long, long day. Thank you for the seven gift subs. I hope any of those seven people come here and watch. That'd be so nice. Finally, some like delicious gameplay. Thank you guys for being so patient. I just had to adjust the prices of some things so that you guys aren't paying more for what you need. Please come back to Kmart and buy all of those fucking potatoes I put on the shelf because y'all motherfuckers ate those up last time. They don't care. They don't care about how I slaved away by my- Jay! Hi girl. I miss you. She's my favorite. Um... I just... They don't care. You know? They come in here and they just expect this to be done, but what they don't know is that I'm just one person. And I had to move all of those shelves all by myself, and you guys don't care, you're just like, ugh, I can't believe I have to stand in a line to buy some stuff. Well, like, you know what? I've had a hard day. It all happens before 8 a.m. You guys aren't in here helping me, and you know what? Even if I hired cashiers, even if I hired people to stock the shelves, guess what? They're not gonna move the whole fucking refrigerator at 8 a.m. That's just something for me to do as the business owner, so 
I know you customers don't appreciate it, but believe me, I'm working my tail off so that you guys can have a lovely experience and fully shock shelves. Have a good day. Hello, sir. Yeah, you, you better look fucking embarrassed. I'm stressed out. <laughs> Who hurt me? Bro, everything hurts. Okay. My body hurts, my shoulder hurts, my back hurts. My ass hurts. My finger hurts. From clicking so much. So basically me. <laughs> so basically I'm 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 hurting me is what's happening actually. And for what? So that I could look at the end of the day that I lost four thousand dollars in one day. It's fine. It will just take a solid month's uh, work to make all that money up again, and to repay my loans, my previous, <laughs> my previous loans. That's okay. It's fine. It's fourteen out of seven. Thank you. Believe me, I know I need a better chair. Please, please, don't remind me. Don't remind me. I hate this chair. I hate. Oh my god. Hi, sir. <laughs> How are you today? Mmm, bleach and soda? That sounds really good. Can I have some? Is that alright? Can I try some? Shop in the darkness. You don't deserve light. You sons of bitches don't deserve light. I'm taking all the lights for me. It's too dark. Y'all, I'm tired. <laughs> Y'all, I'm tired. This is, sir, are you exhausted? Listen, I know it's 9 o'clock and I'm already closed, but you guys came in. Okay, you guys know the hours of operation. You decided to come in after 9 p.m. when you know very well that I am only open till 9. I don't know where you get the audacity to feel like you are welcome in this store this late. But you know you're not. Anyway, have a good day. Sorry, tomorrow will be better. Probably not, but... We can hope. I don't like this guy. He always hands me his card backwards, and I don't like that. Everybody else is normal. This guy's like a fucking alien in a human suit or something. I don't trust that guy. Well, good thing nobody complained, because if they did, I probably would rip my hair out. So that's great. Hello. 
haven't even fucking bought these stupid fucking potato. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's fine. Two days. Here, but went up. The flower went up. Here, but went up. That'll help my profit so much. Oh. Hmm. No. <laughs> Everything's okay. Oh, for a thousand dollars, for two thousand dollars, I can sell more cheese. Who doesn't want to sell more cheese? Brown sugar, green tea. I oh, love to eat cheese. <laughs> <coughs> or I could sell moussaka? Salmon? What is that, a pizza? Steak? Sushi? I wish... I wish the developer of this game... Just let me... Pick what I wanted to buy. <laughs> You know what? Let me buy all the types of cereal now! I have to pay my bills. I have to pay back the bank money. This sucks. <laughs> I hate running a store. It sucks. Nobody's drunk on cheese. I don't want to buy more cheese. Oh my god. After all of that, and then the idea of like, I'm gonna have to rearrange my store again if I buy new products, like... I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to do that. At least these- at least these shelves still look gorgeous. You know what? I'm really happy. I'm still really happy about this. There is a light at the end of the tunnel, you know? Nobody complained. Nobody said my store looked bad. Nobody... Nobody said, uh, you don't have coffee. I had so much coffee. So zero complaints is, is pretty nice. No one said $11 for a jar of honey. That's crazy. They just bought it. Nobody bought milk. Two people want milk? Damn. Easter's coming up. You need to stock up on eggs, everybody. The fuck? Do you not care about Jesus? What the hell? He came back from the dead to eat hard-boiled eggs. You gotta, like, admire him for that. I feel like when I listen to this music, I should be like, 
dancing really poorly while wearing some corduroy flares and also smoking weed in someone's fucking, like, weird basement party. It just- it just gives that vibe. Big time. Rob, hi! How are you doing? How big is the mart now? Look at it! Look at it! There's not a lot going on in there yet, but... Look at my- look at my beautiful refrigerated aisles. Aren't they gorgeous? I worked really hard on them. Like, genuinely, perhaps too hard. <laughs> perhaps thought too much about... Yeah. I'm not buying a goddamn thing today. You know what, if people want to complain and say that my store sucks, you know what, they suck! They could go shop at some other fucking nerd store, you know what? There's plenty of people streaming this game right now, they don't need to shop at my store, they have so many fucking options. I'm not the only store that exists. I did fill that one up already, okay, um... I am gonna buy chicken though. People love chicken. But I don't think I need to buy anything else. I think I already spent five thousand dollars. Open the fucking store. Let's go. <laughs> Get your asses in here, buy some shit, so that I can go home. I wish I could say that to people. You were playing with Laura Croft? You were playing Laura Croft? You were playing... Tomb Raider! Is that the- that's the name of it. It took me a second. Ma'am! How many- oh my god, all my- okay, well, this is a problem. I know I said I wasn't gonna buy anything, but there's like no pasta. I gotta have some pasta, you know? But that's it. <laughs> this is it for the pasta, you better get it. Hello, ma'am. Thank you for buying almost all of the chicken. Oh, this music is loud, dog. Uh... Two yogurt... You're gonna come into my store and... What?! People buy one item! Get out of here! Don't ever fucking come back! I'm so sick... I... I'm so sick of you people. <laughs> Jamie, you never disappoint me. You are such a queen. Jamie, keep this between you and me. Okay. I'm the owner of this place. I'm allowed to give people money if I feel like it. She's a wonderful woman. She comes into my store all the time. She always buys all kinds of things. And you know what? I'm giving her $2 back, okay? I'm letting her have an extra two dollars out of my drawer. It's fine. She deserves it. She hasn't been acting a lot lately. Like <laughs> yeah. It's about damn time y'all started buying stuff in this place. Yeah, oh my god, one hand soap. Get out of here. These people 
people are upsetting me today. It might be because I didn't stock my shelves, so they're mad at me, but like also just buy. There's so much other stuff on the shelf. Hello, ma'am. Thank you so much for being an actual valued customer of Kmart. If you're coming in here and buying one hand soap, you're not a valued customer. That's a lot of cereal, my I mean, I'm not complaining, but that was a lot of cereal. <coughs> Bitch. Get out. I don't even want you to buy this. Even if it is $11. Leave. Shame. Sorry, I didn't have your six-pack of milk. Fucking... Whoever has heard of a six-pack of milk? Everybody's really upset about this milk that I don't have on the shelf. Three giant cans of tuna and some salt. I mean... I can tell what you're gonna eat today, but that's crazy. Yeah, I don't... I don't really understand the milk in bags. Like... How do they... How do they get transported without... breaking? Are the plastic... Is the plastic that strong? And you gotta buy, like, a whole other device to be able to pour your milk later. That's crazy. That shit sounds crazy, man. I mean, cartons are easily recyclable, they are easy to transport, they won't fall apart. I mean, I guess they do also have the same ability to get punctured, but like, I feel like maybe less so. I mean, the fact that you like, and also it's a container that holds it. You know what I'm saying? So, like, the carton, at least, like, they don't go, Okay, well, you buy your carton of milk, and you also have to buy a device to have it later when you want to use it. So, I don't know. I feel like us questioning the milk bag is makes more sense, honestly. This motherfucker. Hand me cat! Stop it! I don't like this guy! Don't come to my store anymore. You keep handing your card to me all weird and it's off-putting and I don't like it. Oops. <gasps> Jamie's back! Oh, girl. I'm so glad you're here again. Oops. She's so cool. She'll never hang out with me, though. She's a celebrity. Long day.
they sell it for two dollars. I mean, if I get a gallon of milk, it's like two fifty. It's not that much of a difference, I guess. I just, I just don't like. I just don't like, like, having to purchase a whole separate thing, you know what I mean? Having to buy the milk jug is crazy. Day's over. I made money today. S lots of people complain, but look, I made money today. That's nice. Apples are just went down. I don't want to change my... Okay, fine. I'll change my prices to match the other one. Sorry, my head hurts. Whew. Hi, Plip. Wowzers. Thank you. Look at my beautiful store. Oh, my hand hurts. Alright. Um. Pay your bills, pay your rent. Pay your bills, pay your rent, pay your loan off. Well, you won't be able to buy alcohol here until, um... Where's the fucking licenses? Um, until I'm level 30, which I'm level 24. No, I don't have... Anyone here to do that for you right now? Sorry. What if I spent two thousand dollars to get some sushi up in here? Then I'd have to spend so much money. No, no, we just spent, we just spent so much money upgrading things. I can't. <laughs> I want to though. I would love to though. Um. Okay, we're just starting our day normally. Thank you for following. Um, we're gonna we're gonna get rid of all of our overstock. We're gonna buy some new products. Wow, literally nobody bought tea. What is the point? What is the point of having tea if not a single person gonna buy it? Waste of shelf space. You'd love to shop here? Well, that would be lovely. But are you a character in the game? Because <laughs> you're welcome to come. Man, I really bought a lot of these. Hold on, wait. Um, I'm gonna need uh, the developer of this game to make sure all of the products have different SKU numbers. Because <laughs> they're all the same. And that's just not realistic enough for me. That's right, nobody wanted tea. Uh, did I get these eggs too? I didn't. There we go. Frozen pizzas. Only one person bought. God oh, damn. Um, okay, that's all our overstock. Now I can just buy everything again. Let's go down the list. 
cereal, bread, one of everything to start off with. That always works out really well for me. Okay, I feel like... Oops, sorry about your car! Um... I do feel better. I do feel better. Uh, you know, now that... Now that the stress... Now that I got to yell at my customers, and the stress of everything is like, melted away a little bit, that's good. We're good now. We're in a good place! We're positive! We're happy! See, this is why you should always be nice to retail employees. You know, they're going through it. They're having- they're having this experience, but just I'm in so real life. Happy, boss. Which, like, cannot be fun. I mean, you know, I don't know how many people independently own and manage a supermarket. So like, oh, I forgot about this tuna that's been sitting out here in the sun. Let's just put it right into the fridge. It'll be fine. It'll be good. swollen they they're just it's just like okay okay just listen it's like an aesthetic thing it's like you know how nowadays it's like really trendy to have like you know like packaging and like art that's like bubbly and like round and like squishy like that's the that's basically it's just it's just a very aesthetic tuna you want the round, bubbly, squishy packaging of tuna. It, it's cool. It's cool and contemporary. Fuck, I bought more tea. God, I'm so stupid. Stop buying fucking tea. I didn't need this milk either. Um, oh. Oh my goodness. What do you mean, what? Listen... Did you guys know... That, like... Listen, okay, so like, Jello changed their packaging recently, right? They changed- they changed their look. They're like, that look was very 90s, we need to change it for 2024. And they made everything, like, so cute and so round. And I'm just saying, my tuna is cute and round. And probably fine to eat. I didn't buy the milk. I haven't gotten there yet. I'm just buying like one of everything or stuff for sure that I know. I, that whole that whole aisle is, uh, is a little crazy. This aisle over here is a little nuts. I haven't had tuna in so long. I love a good tuna sandwich. I mean, people do that, you know, they like... 
you go to Walmart and you find like a steak in the like toy section. You know somebody out there is just putting that back in the fridge, you know? Like it's it's bound to have happened. Tuna casserole? I've never had it. Tuna and noodles does not sound good together. For some reason. I've had, like... Like, noodles and chicken. And for some reason that sounds fine in my brain, but... Tuna is very special, you know? I don't need two of these. I need one of these. One of those. None of those. Perco soda. I wonder how the developer of this game is doing. I always kind of wonder, like, like what, like when there's these like indie games or just like something that's made by like one person. And they happen to get, like, like, it just happens to be a hit. Like, how are they feeling? Like, like genuinely, I want to know. Like, everything. Like, are they happy that they, like, like, are making money? Do they feel like they set the price right? Do they, like... Are they having a hard time because now there's just like a lot of demand about their game? Like I like I have so many genuine questions for them. I don't need those eggs. Get out of there. Message and ask. I think that dude's probably very busy. <laughs> And wouldn't have time to answer those types of questions. It's like, remember when, like, Flappy Bird was, like, the shit? And that guy was like, you know what? I'm just gonna fucking delete this. <laughs> like, like, I get it, though. Like, I, like, I totally get it. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it was very, like, unexpected, and there probably was, like, a lot of attention, and he was just like, whoa, like, no. You know, I get that. I mean, I don't exactly know why he, you know, decided to do what he did, but he just seemed very stressed out by the whole thing, so... That's why, that's why I'm always, like, interested, like... Is this person surprised? Like, are they happy that it got so successful? Are they like they 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 did an update, so clearly they were like, this is something that I want to work on, you know. Well, that's, like, so, like, I looked at, um, I was looking at the, like, Steam forums, you know, like, for the game. Like, if you look on the community page and there's, like, a little forum thingy. And I already saw people, like, just saying a lot of shit. I was like, 
I guess some people don't do like do people understand that this game was like made by a person, you know, and not like a giant software developer, you know what I'm saying? Like do they get that? Like does that bo like this is why I wish I was a journalist, you know. I could be like, "Oh, I'm writing an article on fucking, I don't know, some made-up gamer website." Gamer news, <laughs> gamernews.com. Um, I'd like to ask you a few questions. I still could be. I could not be. Um. Okay, we need. We're pretty good on all of this stuff. I don't think I really need to fill it up that much. Um. I think we need more toilet paper, more flour. What was this? And soap. That was just random shit. Okay. Uh, so more toilet paper, more bleach, more milk. People really liked that milk. Um, some toilet paper, some milk, some bleach. And I think that's pretty good for the day start with. We're getting two shells of this milk. People are- people in this town love to guzzle milk. They just love to have a little handheld milk on them all day, every day. Water? I don't know where. It's milk for me, baby. Yeah. We'll just put this here because it's like my overstock shelf. Okay, so I need all of the flowers. Two of those flowers. That guy. The blue one. And that's it. Oh, sorry, ma'am. empty shelf, which I will fill with... Uh, cleaner. It's not that much. Sure, that'll do. Let's go. Let's make some money. Cause we've lost so much. Jesus. The music, chill. So intense. I'm not making bank. I'm just doing my best. See, here's the problem. Okay, I already see a problem in my future, which is this is going to bother me that it's by a window and I'm going to want to move it to back here in the back of the store. All of the refrigerator aisles. So I'm gonna have to move all of these and then move them all here. You know? I should have done that in the first place. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. We'll figure it out when we get there. We're not gonna get there for a while. I'm not gonna, like. I can't expand the store until I have more shit, right? So I need the next thing I hello. The next thing I need to do is Jesus, you fucking wake up in the morning, you put those shoes on. It's 9 a.m. Um I'm gonna need to buy a license and more shelves and put more stuff on the shelves before I even think about moving anything because then I need to make money off of that so that I can expand my store. Hi sir, how are you today? Your forehead's real shiny. That's crazy. That's a lot of reflection going on over there. Stop staring at customers. Listen, if some girl walks into my store in a in a mini skirt and stilettos at 9 a.m., I'm gonna be like, what was the decision making process this morning? Like, number one, um, how do I get to be as confident as you? And number two, don't your feet hurt? 
Do you need a pair of slippers to shop in? Are those the only shoes you own? I'd have a lot of questions for her. Hey, dude. Jesus. Okay. do. Sorry, I got confused, ma'am. Wearing heels casually seems awful. I mean, like, it depends on the heel entirely. Like, platform shoes, uh, like platform heels. Really, the platform just gives you the illusion that the heel's that high, but it's like really not that hard to like walk around in. Um, but stilettos are, stilettos are a different bitch. Stilettos are like, you better hope that you don't encounter any, like, hole in the ground or some soft ground. Because, like, that that heel is going straight in there. And you're going to have a hard time getting it out. I remember one time wearing, like, heels. And I had to, like, walk to, like, a car. I think it was, like, Easter. And, like, we had to park in a weird place because it was Easter. So I had to like walk over grass. My shoe got stuck. <laughs> I was like, well, I know what I'm never wearing ever again as long as I live, so. I learned many lessons that day. I mean, those shoes look nice. I'm not hating on her for her, for her wearing the shoes. I just, it was just too, it was just 8 a.m. It was just 8 a.m., okay? Those poor twin girls. They're definitely the, like, family that, like, has twins and, like, names them basically the same exact name and gives them the hair, same haircut, and, like, Everything has to be identical because they're twins and oh my god, isn't that so cute? And then those twins go up, grow up having like the worst identity issues because they don't feel like a whole entire person on their own because they constantly got confused for their sibling. You know, like that kind of thing. That's what's going on in this family. Hey, have a yeah. great day! <laughs> I wasn't talking shit about your whole family. What the fuck? I've always had this- I've always had this feeling about twins or, like, siblings that, like, grow up around the same age range, you know? Like, like, especially twins, though, I feel really bad when a parent doesn't, like, individualize them, you know what I'm saying? Like, they're two separate human beings, and I understand they came out of your pussy at the same time. But, they are two whole separate human beings, and should be treated as such. You shouldn't dress them exactly the same. You really shouldn't give them cutesy rhyming names. You know? You should- you should give them a sense of individuality. I'm never gonna have kids, so I'm allowed to judge. <laughs> I'm allowed to judge people with no experience of my own. I just always thought it was weird. And then like occasionally you'll see those like... Like I remember watching I Want to Say It Was My Strange Addiction or something similar to that. And it was like these twins, these twin girls, 
and they were like 50 something years old never never had a boyfriend kind of vibe lived together uh and then there was like this one part where they were like they were trying to talk about how in tune they are as twins and like and they like were trying really hard to watch the other yeah they're trying to watch the other twins speak so that they can finish the sentence even though they could not do it at fucking all like it was and that's what i'm saying like when you don't when you don't allow children to have their individual personalities they don't know what to do when they're older so like i'm glad they have each other but once one of them dies that other one's gone immediately like they don't know what to do it was- it wasn't creepy, it was just sad. And I just feel bad for them, <laughs> basically. Maybe I should slow down on my clicking, because my finger hurts. A hundred... okay. It still shocks me every time. Is that it? That's my last customer of the day? Thank you ma'am, appreciate you. No complaints? I lost a hundred and thirteen dollars, that's... Fine? <laughs> that's fine. Parmesan cheese went down, the salt went up. The oh my god, I'm not gonna remember any of that. Salt went up. Parmesan went down. Parmesan. Yeah, see, like, like, I think, okay, when you're babies, okay, it's fine. You know what I mean? A baby doesn't know what the fuck is going on, period. But, like, yeah, I think, like, I think it's important. Uh, this is, I'll never have kids, so maybe I'm wrong. Uh, but I feel like if I was a parent, I'd be like, you know what? I want my kids to feel like, 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 like a, like a special individual human being, you know? It's like, if they have, like, they're obviously gonna have a birthday on the same day, but I would still, like, go out of my way to make sure they had their own, like, experience on their birthday, because I think it's sad when, like, kids have to share everything. Just so that when they're older, they could be like, yeah, you know, I can, I can do my own birthday thing without my fucking twin or whatever, like... I mean, plenty of people who can't afford kids are having them, so I don't think that's really the- I don't think that's really the main issue. I mean, for me, it is. It's a part of the problem. Also, the part where you, like, are in a relationship, that part, and, like, wanting- like, the, like having the option to have kids, like, that's also not happening, but, like, anyway, uh, <laughs> there's multiple factors to this problem. This fucking tea is not selling! Why do I have it here? God damn. Anytime I hear people talk about, like, having kids, they always, like, seem like they don't want them. <laughs> And I feel like that's enough of a sign for anybody to be like, maybe... Maybe I don't. Maybe I shouldn't contribute to this issue.
The only reason to have a kid, I think, is to maybe hope and pray that they're f they become famous. And that, like, they like you and will buy you everything you want when they're rich and famous. Otherwise, it doesn't really seem like a great return on investment. You know, like it. You just hope that they become famous and you try to make them as well adjusted as a, of a human being as they possibly can be so that they don't have any like weird issues. Like I think that's I think that's what every parent is secretly doing, but they just like won't admit it. Harry of the bloodline. Yeah, but like who cares about that? You're not a fucking royal. You're just some average idiot. You know what I mean? Who cares if your bloodline exists or not? Like the royals care about it because they think they matter in some way, but like me fucking care. Free labor for your farm. Okay, well, that's fair. Again, there's value in that. It it's not it's not the it's not the best type of value. Free child labor is not what we should be aiming for. But like I'm just saying like contemporary reasons. You know, I don't I, I'm not even entirely sure people that work on a farm now are doing that to the they probably are, but I don't know for sure. What's in this? Oh, the chicken. <laughs> okay, enjoy that botulism chicken. Where's my bread? It's over here. I need to save this box because it's always the wind giving me problems later down the line. Children shouldn't be your retirement plan. I mean, like, yeah. I agree with that. But I'm just saying, I think... I just think... I think that's what... I feel like that's what... <laughs> I feel like that's what most people are banking on. I don't even know what I'm buying right now. But I'm buying it. But I'm doing it. Do I need... I don't know. That's fine. This fucking milk. Oh, no one even bought this milk this time. I invested in too much milk! I'm fucking boned. Okay, that's fine. It'll be fun. <laughs> Nobody want this shit either. Dang. Well, they bought it from here. See, what, what I'll do, if I ever go crazy and want a child... I'll just like... I'll just like work at a fire department and then like wait until somebody just like drops off their child that they didn't want. And then I'll take care of that kid. Cause like, I'm not rich enough to afford a, to adopt a child either, so like, it's kind of like when you want a puppy but like you can't pay for one. So you're like, gee, I sure hope my neighbor's dog has puppies one day so that you could be like, oh, can I get one of those? You know? What if you win money or something? I s if I win money, I'm not spending that on a child. <laughs> There's no, there's no way. You know who needs money? Me. I'm pretty... I'm a pretty good thing to spend money on, I think.
Okay. Uh, I think I'm gonna need some more coffee. And I think that's it. Maybe coffee, coffee, salt, the flowers. The flowers always seem to sell. Uh, uh, coffee. Salt. Then we can start our day again. I do like that the size of this store means that I don't like constantly have to be buying a ton of product. Buy it all once, don't have to think about it that much anymore. The Labala Laba Lab La 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 ba lane la lane is that of a mermaid with her titties out <laughs> i guess it is sea salt so makes sense hard to say though Well, our stocks all stocked up. I gotta check the prices because I don't remember everything that changed. Uh, oil went down. Salt went up. Oil, salt, apple juice, Parmesan cheese. I think I changed those things. Oh shit, I need oil. Look. Um... Salt went up. My price is fine. Parmesan cheese, I think I already changed this. And I think I already changed this. Hmm. Well. Okay. Uh, what did I need? Oil. Olive oil. Olive oil. Olive oil. Olive oil. Just drink it. We'll just open the store now, because I can stock that while people are coming in. Because it always takes them forever to come in. That sounds rough. I guess I should also probably get some sugar. Oh, we'll get some sugar too. One box of sugar, please. Excuse me. There we go. Hi. I was here the whole time. Hi! Well, you can hire stalkers now. I didn't even see that. I need to look at that. How much does it cost to hire a person who will stock the shelves for me? I don't know. It may not be worth it. $15.99! Bye! Hello, sir. A lot of candy for you today. I feel that. Oh man, a few days ago I ordered groceries because I kept, like, sleeping in too late to order groceries. So I was like, you know what, I'm gonna plan this ahead of time. I'm gonna order my groceries. It's gonna get here later in the day, but I ordered them before the cutoff time, so it'll be fine. To make my life more convenient. And then they came, and they didn't have half my shit. And I was very upset. <laughs> like, you know, looking back on it, it's pretty silly to get so upset about something like that. But I was like, what's the point? You know what I mean? Like, what was the point of going through, like, three days of, like, ugh, I keep, I keep, like, not ordering this in time because they have very specific windows 
to deliver stuff and like I was like okay today's the day I'm gonna I'm gonna do my big old grocery order so that I don't have to think about it I'll have my food set for like a couple weeks it'll be great and then I do it and then everything everything that was frozen in the order did not arrive and I was just like I was so irritated. <laughs> I was just so annoyed. I'm like, the whole point of doing this is to like make my life more convenient. And like, okay. And it's like one thing to be like, all right, that's fucking annoying. I'm gonna have to go. I'm gonna have to go there myself now, which was the whole point of not like not doing that, because I couldn't go there. So it was like the whole point was to make it. anyway. Okay, yeah, fine. And then I go on the website to get like a refund. And it's like, which transaction was it? Okay, pick the transaction. Which items? Please list the specific items. And then after we list the items, press OK to confirm that these are the items. Because it's AI bullshit, right? And I'm like, OK. And I list all of the items one by one, which was a lot of items. And I was like, OK. And I go through the list. It's like, all right. And it's like, are these the items you'd like a refund on? Yes. We'll contact you with a person uh, in the in the chat to confirm the. the okay, all right, that's fine. And then I talk to the person, uh, and they're like, "Can you list all of the items <laughs> that you want a refund for?" And I was like, "I literally, I just did this. Like, okay, okay." I was like, "Oh, I I just did that with the with the AI thing." Do I have to list all of the items again? They're like, let me check the items. Okay. And then they check the items and then they send me the list with like... M some of the things missing from the list that I already confirmed of all of the items that were missing. I'm like, no. <laughs> and it's just like, it's so annoying to have to deal with like... When you're already annoyed... Having to deal with like, just little things like that is like I should I just shouldn't have bothered in the first place. So like I've learned my lesson, which is don't ever order groceries online. Only ever go to the grocery store to buy groceries because they will fuck it up. And like I just I can't handle that type of disappointment in my life on a regular basis. You know, if I go to the store and they don't have the thing, that's fine. And then and then, some of the items that I bought, they were like, nope, sorry, out of stock. And then I go to the store later, and they were fully in- I went to the store the same day. Okay. I went to the store the same day. And everything was there. So I was like, not only- <laughs> Not only did I have to waste my time doing this. You lied to me. And I hate being lied to. I hate that so much. Do not fucking lie to me. Well, that's the thing. They're like, it wasn't like a, it wasn't like a, like an Instacart order, which, God, I'm so sorry if you ever had to order Instacart. It's almost always bad. Um, it wasn't an Instacart thing. It was like through the store. And they have like very specific delivery windows because it's like somebody, they have like a truck with the fucking store name on the side. So it's like, it's a, it's a store thing. It's not like a just random person shopping for your groceries thing. So they had to have the, the employees of the store were just being lazy. And as you guys have heard throughout my playthrough of playing this game, while I believe retail is easy, like, it, like it, it's really not that hard to it's just, it's just not, it's, it's, it's just easy. I just think it's just easy. <laughs> if you're, if your job in the morning is to pick groceries, it's really not that hard. Why are you saying things are out of stock when they're very obviously in stock? You know what I'm saying? And I, and I can only say this. Hi, Jamie. Thank you for interrupting my rant. I really appreciate seeing you. I hope you have a lovely day. Um... I only just say this because I had that same experience, like, um, when I did online orders at my store. You know, it was very specific on where to find the items. 
you know? And rarely would it be, like, in a weird spot that you might have missed. You know what I'm saying? Like, sometimes somebody would be lazy and put a over put them in an over overstock box that it shouldn't have been in. Like, okay. But that means that I literally couldn't find it. You know what I mean? Like, I would have to dig through boxes that were unable to see through. If it was on a shelf, easy to do. So that's why I'm like, this person was just... Whoever was picking the order was just being an asshole. Because they were like, Hi Alice, thank you. They were just like... <laughs> they were just like, Oh, this whole entire freezer? Full of Cool Whip? We don't have any. Yes, you do! <laughs> I went to the store and saw it myself! Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you for the raid. Oh. I made some money today. That feels nice. My mozzarella cheese. All my cheeses are going down in price. Where's my mots? Ah, it's not too bad. Anyway, I could rant about retail forever, and I feel like I have. Damn, nobody's buying the fucking yogurt. I spent all this money in a whole yogurt shelf, and nobody's buying it. Like, okay, this is this is how ridiculous. This is how ridiculous it was. Okay. This is how absolutely ridiculous this was. So, I didn't get my order of anything that was frozen. One of the things was Cool Whip, because I wanted to make, like, a dessert, right? And they were like, out of stock. We don't have it. Now, imagine you walk through to the grocery store, and you're like, I need some yogurt. And you saw this. Because they said... <laughs> my order said the yogurt was gone. The frugan yogurt is out of stock. And then you walked into the store and you saw this. My fucking brain exploded. I was like, what do you... How dare you? How dare you tell me this shit is out of stock when I can see it with my own eyeballs. A full refrigerator full of it. It's crazy. Oh god, nobody bought the tea again, I don't think. <laughs> Two things of tea? Oy. This has, like, been a loss for me. This tea. Worthless. Nobody accuses you of anything in this game. They're just like, you don't have it. Well, I think, I think one time they said that some stuff was overpriced. I think that does happen in this game, but... It doesn't, like, negatively affect you, really. Or it doesn't seem like it is. And like, I don't... It's it's very frustrating. See, like, I understand why people... Why people act like Karens, you know? Occasionally, sometimes you're like, I just, I just wanna, I just... I just wanna understand the reasoning. You know what I'm saying? Like... I just want to know, I just, like, <laughs> I don't want anything to happen, alright? I don't want anyone to get in trouble or lose their job, but I just want to know why. I just want to know why. I just want to know. You know what, I worked retail. If you said, you know what, I just didn't feel like doing it. I'd be like, that sucks, but at least, <laughs> at least you were honest about it. Um... But that's the thing. I'll never know. I'll never know. I'll never ask to find out why things happen. And some people do that. Some people are like, nope, I'm gonna go to the store and I'm gonna bitch and complain. And all you're doing by doing that is just... It's just causing issues for these people that don't get paid enough money to deal with your fucking bullshit. You know? Unfortunately, that's, that's the truth of it. So even though you want to know why someone would just not do the thing that they're supposed to do, you'll just never know. Oh, 
leveled my third. Oh, one went out. Sick. That's also like, I think one of my favorite things in the world is like when I see, um, speaking of Instacart, when I see people who have like Instacart orders and they get the most like insane replacements for items, like, it'll be like, uh, I want, you know, some chicken breast and then they'll just like get like 25 bags of like chicken tenders and you're like, no. That's not an equivalent to the chicken breasts I wanted. I want to know what's happening there. I would genuinely love to get answers for that one. I want to see the person shopping for the item and like see... See that go through their brain and be like, no, this is a good idea. This is exactly what I should be doing in this situation. I'm just lucky I never worked in a place that actually allowed substitutions for shit because that would have been fucking crazy. I don't know what I need, so I'm just buying based on vibes right now. My vibes are correct though. Oh my god. My ass is hurting. I really need to get out of this chair. <laughs> but I love this game. You guys have no idea how many times I just like have wanted to load this up and just played like you know, in my spare time. I'm like, what if what if I just started a stream and I just had like the biggest fucking supermarket universe? I have everything maxed out. Every aisle is immaculate. Yeah, I mean, I'll, uh, I'll stream for a little bit longer, and then I'll be done for the night, but I'm just having a good time. I just genuinely really like this game. It's just so simple and so nice. do we need what do we need spaghetti pasta potatoes <coughs> spaghetti pasta and potatoes spaghetti pasta and potatoes pasta spaghetti pasta potatoes go and I think I can open my store. You know what? We're just gonna- we're just literally gonna open it right now. No problem, chief. Oh, I forgot to look- oh, I keep forgetting. I have the worst fucking memory, I swear. I wanted to check out the, uh... The uh, cost of like people to hire. Because I don't ever look at that. Because I'm determined to do this on my own. Ugh. I don't need that right now. That's overstocked. Sorry about the lights! Now you guys can see, uh, okay, let's see. Man, 
management? Hiring. Cashier what cashier? Oh, restockers. Restockers. Purchase rack. Purchase rack? What does that mean? Oh, like shelf shelves? I have to get a rack to man. I'm not doing all that. Hi! How are you today, sir? Thank you for buying tea and water for your tea. I love that. I don't want to. I don't want to buy a storage shelf just so that I can see the cost of a human being. That's so silly. I don't have chicken! Oh my god, guys. I gotta get some chicken. Shit, I fucked up. I didn't even look in my freezers. I'm s Hold on. I gotta get some chicken. You'll be fine. You're here, like, all the time. This is really important. This is, like, the most important thing. Believe me, these people really need their chicken. Who- those boxes are just gonna sit outside for a minute. They'll be fine. It's a cool day today. <coughs> just a second, sir. <coughs> okay. Hi, how are you today? Thank you so much for waiting patiently. Your total is $103.91. Thank you so much. Have a great day. I promise I don't have COVID. Honestly, you should be masking up. It's not my responsibility. They don't require that at my store anymore. If you're scared about your health, you should be worried about it. I don't know what to tell you. Watch nobody buy any chicken now. And it's not because they can see that there's two boxes of it sitting outside in the sun. It's just because that's my luck. You invest, and they just say, nope, not interested. There's no bleach? Damn. Who bought all the bleach? See, that woman loves chicken. If it wasn't for me, she would starve. Look at it. Bought all that chicken. We didn't have french fries, but she could have bought those potatoes and made her own. It's not that hard to do. I don't. God damn it, all these people love french fries. What am I, McDonald's? They're never gonna be as good as going to. Mi Just go to McDonald's, okay? If you're like, you know what, for dinner, we're having chicken and french fries, just go to McDonald's and buy the french fries. You're gonna- you're gonna get your frozen french fries and you're gonna cook them in the air fryer and they're not gonna taste as good. And you're gonna be disappointed anyway, so might as well just cut that out. Thanks. Should I get more bleach? No. No. <laughs> no, I'm making money today. I'm not spending another dime. I think most of the time it's just because, like, if you're making fries at home, it's like, there's a lot of... If you want, like, a good fry, you gotta, like, double fry and shit. It's like, nobody has time for that shit, so they just take their frozen fries and, like, throw it in the oven and call it a day, it just... You know? It's not the- it's not the same as getting, like, a freshly fried delicious fry. Thank you, sir. Those 
Hold on. That's a lot of in-game noise. There's birds chirping. There's what sounds like a boat. The fuck is that? Try to muffle that a little bit here. Thank you. I love my customers. My customers are the most important thing to me. I care about the health and well-being of my customers so that they may continue to work themselves to the bone so that I may have their money for my products so that I can work myself to the bone so that I can live a good life, maybe. Don't! This guy... I missed out on a lot of bleach sales today. That's a bummer. What can you do? It's a lazy day. Did everyone just decide that today was the day they were gonna buy bleach? Please get out of my store. <laughs> I'm being simple. Thank you for buying those potatoes, ma'am! We have so many of them. They're gonna rot before anybody eats them. Thanks, dude. Fucking french fries and bleach. Who could have guessed? I'm gonna guess that those would have been the sales for today. 14 complaints. 43 customers. I feel like I always get 40-something customers. How do I get more customers? We are making money again. That's pretty sick. Hello? My game crash. Hello? Uh oh. Okay. There we go. The rice went up, the apple juice went down. Yeah, my price is fine. Um... I might need a second register. No, 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 no. It's just me. It's just me! Okay. Um... Okay, first of all... I have way too many bills to pay. I was gonna get excited for a second. I was like, ooh, I can buy stuff. Nope. We paid off our loan! Do we take out another loan? And ruin our lives? What licenses do I have? Okay, I don't want to exp extend it because it'll fucking drive me crazy. Because it only- it's gonna make a random square that'll upset me. I cannot expand this store again until I have $7,000 extra. Because <laughs> I need it to be a perfect square. You know? That's crazy to think about. But like, I want to buy this shit. What is this? Crab stick, hot sauce, ice cream, ketchup, mayonnaise, pizza. $2,000 though? Should I buy this shit first? Is 
This is a tough decision because I will be spending all of my money that I have right now. Because I'll have to buy more shelves and probably a new freezer and more fridges. So... I could either sell sushi or I could sell more coffee and more cheese and more eggs and more pasta and more sugar and more tea. Nobody cares about tea. I feel like I want this. I feel like I want the- I feel like I want this and I'm gonna- I'm gonna buy- This is so much though. This is 3,000. This is a little bit more manageable. We're gonna go with the, the middle one here. Ooh. Alright. <laughs> Let's look at our stuff that we just got. We've got sushi that goes in the fridge. We got sushi that goes in the fridge. We got steak that goes in the fridge. We got veal chop that goes in the fridge. Scallop gratin, gratin goes in the fish. Fish? It goes in the fridge. All of this shit goes in the fridge. I just bought a bunch of fridge shit. I gotta buy more fridges. I gotta buy two more fridges. I gotta buy two for each side. I gotta buy two for each side. I gotta buy two for each side. There's nine new products. <laughs> that still doesn't math the way that I want it to. But what can you do? Oh shit. Um. I mean, now how do I organize this? <laughs> now how do I organize this in a way that makes sense? I don't think I can. How big can you end up making this store? I genuinely have no idea. So like, it expands in blocks of 4x4. Four four. So, it can get pretty big, as you can see. Yeah, it can be huge. It can be a huge supermarket. Oh my god, could you imagine having this much money? Oh my god, are people making that much money in this game? It's okay, I'm having a good time. At my own slow pace. <laughs> I'm doing fine. Um, I think... I think I'm just gonna... I think I'm just gonna have to, like... Uh, oh... I think I'm... Uh, no, my yogurt shelf is perfect. I'm not gonna change it. Um, I do have a lot of butter, though. But I'll never have to buy butter again, you see. Um, okay, we're gonna start with the sushi. We'll get two of these. And two of these. Oh my god, I literally have no money. I actually do need to take out a loan. That's... Crazy. Okay, um... Wow. 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 Incredible stuff. And these are the small sushis. Where... How do they stack, though? Okay, that's fine. You know what? This is fine. We're learning right now. Right now, there's a little bit of a learning curve. Oh shit, I forgot about this chicken. It's fine. It's still good. When will I hire workers? Probably when it's really big. I can still handle this. I'm still managing and I don't have to pay anybody anything, so... We'll get one of these, one of these, we'll get one of everything else. 
and just see where it goes on the shelf. Oh my god, I have $28. Fuck. Um... Uh... Wow, that's crazy. I'm gonna put that on the other shelf, actually. I did not think it would come out like that. What's this guy? Okay. Okay. Musaka. Oh my god, I want some. I asked my mom to make me some, so I don't have to make steak. Lots of steak. The whole box of steak? That's crazy. Yeah, should I take out a loan or should I just start my day? You know what? I'm just gonna start my day. Fuck it. We're just trying to make a little bit of a profit. We're gonna put all our overstock on the shelf. And we're just- we're just gonna do our best. People will complain, people will hate me, but listen, it's for the benefit. I don't want to take out another loan. Somebody better fucking buy all this yogurt! <laughs> one's buying it. one's buying my yogurt. I really did maybe invest too much in the yogurt, honestly. Um, but you never know. You never know what kind of person. Maybe somebody needs to get like 700 things of yogurt for a school trip. I don't know. I don't know. I have to be here, ready. People need to buy that soda. It's good for you. It's healthy. It's basically water. Oh my god, I don't have bleach. People really needed that bleach. I put the wrong thing there. Fuck. Is the yogurt strawberry or cherry? Um, it seems to be a strawberry kiwi grape and orange fruit. It's fruit flavored. Probably tastes good. You should buy some. Let's try it. I honestly would love some yogurt right now. I would love a big fat orange. I'm still thinking about so that yummy. orange I had last week. That shit was so good. I don't have any more fries. I'm not putting the fries in there. I have so much pizza. You guys are going to eat the pizza and you're going to enjoy it. My fucking mafia pizza what is that, needs a pizza? to go. Is that it? Is that all of it? I hate that I can't see what's in the box unless I put it down because I'm holding it. It would be nice to be able to see into the box a little bit better. Oh, the butter. The butter that nobody buys. I made a mistake with this too. This, this day is basically going to be a fundraising day. I'm not going to make a lot of money. People are going to complain that stuff is not on the shelves. And, you know, I... I'm sorry, I only have $28, okay? If you don't get your chicken today or your french fries, I'm very, very sorry. 
there won't be a new shipment for the next seven days. Alright, we're just gonna go for it. Let's go. Yeah, I really want... I want orange. I need to go buy some fruit. I have bananas. And I'm not like the biggest fan of bananas. I'll eat a banana. But nothing compares. There's like certain fruits. Certain melons. I can't wait. I can't wait for watermelon season. I can't wait. I need a cantaloupe. I need a honeydew. I need a watermelon. I need to mix them all up in a bowl and just devour it. I never set the prices for any of that stuff. Oh my god. Stop coming into my store. Stop buying things! <laughs> 3... 50... Why didn't you guys tell me? 13 dollars. Oh my god. 13 dollars. Fucking hell. Fifteen dollars. I can't believe you guys let me do this. Ten dollars. You guys all- oh, go ahead. Spend all your money. Get sushi on the shelves. And then- and then tell- and then not tell me that I didn't put prices on it. How dare you guys. Was that it? Was that all the new stuff I bought? I'm so- I can't believe you people. Hello, sir. How are you today? I'm sorry about the random price. 712? Oh. Y'all are not gonna find a lot of products today, believe me. You guys ever have that feeling that, like, some piece of clothing rubbing against you is like a bug? One time? My, uh, my cousin was over, and we had that exact conversation, and I was like, I was like scratching my arm, and I said that to her, and I was like, don't you ever feel like sometimes just like a, a like a bug crawling on you, it's like your hair or whatever, and she's like, yeah, and she starts scratching her leg, and then a bug fell out of her pant leg, and it was the funniest fucking thing, I was scared for a second, because I was like, oh my god, a bug, and then I died laughing. Because that is just too fucking funny. Things happen to her that is just so hilarious. Yeah, it was gross, but it was funny as fuck. <laughs> it was funny. I was like, what are the odds? What are the odds? Because so many times, like, I stay here and I freak out. Because I'm like, oh god. And it's just, like, my hair. You know, like, a hair that's fallen out of my head and is, like, on me now. Um, but it is never a bug. Unless I'm outside. But we were inside my house. <laughs> that was so funny. Sorry everyone about the lack of items on the shelf today. We are currently doing a fundraiser. The funds is for me to get more money so that I don't have to take out a loan so that I can continue to buy products for you guys. So. If you're concerned about me not having enough stuff on the shelf, consider buying other products so that we may continue to, you know, uh, have the products you want. See, look, this guy's doing his part. He's buying all the butter he can. Does he need that much butter? Probably not. But I appreciate... I appreciate you, sir. I actually want to see how many people will complain today. Ma'am, we don't need sales like hers here. <laughs> Get out of here! You're buying two yogurts? Jackie, baby! Hey, girl. I can always count on her. And she never complains. And she never complains! She's such a queen. I love her so much. I 
I can't wait to sell alcohol. That's just gonna cost so much. Hire a stalker? No. I'm the stalker. Why would I hire- I'm sitting here saying I have $28 to my name. How am I gonna hire anybody? I can barely pay myself. You nuts. Uh, there needs to be two up there, my bae. Yeah, buy that moussaka. Fuck yeah. I've never seen frozen moussaka. I guess moussaka is really different for like different people. Um, the way that my mom has made it my entire life has been just like meat, ground beef, um, potatoes. And with like a little bit of egg on top. Delicious. Um, but I think a lot of people have like eggplant. And there's like, it's like not a meaty thing. I need to know the origin of the word because like, what does it mean exactly? Pay them in yogurt? Mm. I don't know if anyone's willing to take that job, honestly. Would you like to be paid in yogurt? You'd have to really love yogurt. With the lack of other options, people are buying the yogurt, though. A hundred dollars, exactly! That's crazy. Oh no, she gave me a hundred- that's okay, I can do math. It's fine. You get paid in free food? Uh... I don't know. I get, get paid in groceries. <laughs> you work at the grocery store and they're like, yeah, you can just buy whatever groceries you want. You know? Like, you can't... Like, they won't let you buy toilet paper, but they'll be like, any of the fresh veggies and shit you want, go for it. I'd be down for that. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. That'd be awesome, actually. You know, from starting out with $28... Not the worst. Alright. Get out of here. I'm close. Oof. Oh! <laughs> Products found expensive, one. Fuck you. How about you fuck off? Okay, sorry. <laughs> sorry. Uh... None of my prices are expensive. Everything I have is below the average price of shit. Don't you dare complain. Stop again. At least I feel safe enough to buy some stock this time around. Even though I'm still like kind of baffled by my refrigerator section now. It's all different now. But people don't care. They just want their sushi. Oh, fuck. Mm. 
It's not... It's not... Listen. I just can't afford to buy the products, okay? They exist. You can go to another grocery store that has them. I just... I can't. I can't buy... I'm poor. <laughs> I'm so poor. Is there butter in there? There's still butter in there. Okay. Uh, did anybody buy that tea? Tea, that's good. Will I ever get rid of this box of tea? Probably not. Fuck. <laughs> Don't fall. Okay. Um. Let's start with our candy shelf. We just need some candy. Okay. It's getting hard to find where things are anymore. We need one of those. We need one of these. You know, the most important essential candy and cake. That's great. Okay, we need bleach. We need hand soap. We need these guys. We need that guy. Probably need one of these. I still don't really have enough money to be fully stocked, but it's okay. We're getting there. Let me take this guy down. What are you talking about? What's up? Um, not much. Just... Dreading existence. So how are you doing? We need more bleach. We need more soap. We need that. We need that. Oh my god. Oh, I thought I bought the hand soap. Okay, it's not. Maybe I'm gonna have to take out. I don't want to take out a loan. But I'm gonna have to. This? This. Nope. All my prices are excellent! How dare anybody complain? What the fuck? Whatever. Um. Edible. Edible? These are not edible. They're lying to you. Okay. Cereal, bread, flour, oil, pasta, sugar. I don't know about my frozen stuff yet. Coffee. No tea. <laughs> no. You know, Mars Attacks was a really interesting movie. I remember liking it. You know what I remember about Mars Attacks that isn't really directly related to it? There was a, um... There was a, um... A, like, spirit Halloween Mars Attacks alien that you could buy. 
But it was like the size of a regular human and I was like... Now, it's supposed to be a decoration and it's... And I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure the aliens in that movie, not that big. So I was very confused as to like... Who designed it and who like approved it because like it didn't make any fucking sense. Oh shit, I can't move that. Yeah, it was like it was it was tall. It was pretty tall, and I was like, aren't they supposed to be short? Like am I am I wrong? Still just getting one of everything so far. Peanut butter. Flour, olive oil, spaghetti, fries, salt. I don't need any more candy. Cereal for sure. The milk. Shelf milk. Everybody loves shelf milk. and nutritious and good for you. Oh, oh, well, this one goes here. I thought this was the bee cereal. See you, dude. To move this guy. I need a box for it. I probably should have thrown away all the boxes I've been using. I always forget about that. I can't throw this one away. Hello? Music was like, I, I give up. <laughs> I retire. I don't want to do this anymore. <laughs> That's exactly what we needed. That's what we needed. Just that that song on repeat. Speaking of developers, uh, we weren't, but I was earlier. Um, I really want to know why. I really just want to know why the Lucius developers broke my heart. Can I buy the IP from them for like twenty dollars? Do you think they'll let? Do you think they'll let me? Cause I, I still feel. It's the only time I've ever felt maternal in my life. Like that little boy is mine. You know what I'm saying? He's my child. I need to take care of him. And the fact that he was abandoned by everybody just. It just makes me really sad, you know? He didn't deserve that. He's just a little boy. He's just a little baby. It was just so sad. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't have bought this cereal. There's a lot of cereal. Um... Okay, what the fuck? am I doing? Um, I don't know. Do we just run the day? Let's just run the day again. We still have so much shit. We, just, we need chicken though. We need chicken and oh my god. No, I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't possibly do that right now. Um, we're gonna need some chicken. And we're gonna need some french fries. And they're just gonna sit outside in the sun. For a little while. Hmm. 
I'll be able to restock these, no problem. Alright, store's open, let's go. I need to make some money. Am I making bank? <laughs> What'd they do? Um, the game was just like totally fucking broken. The last one. And they just like stopped giving a shit. And I'm pretty sure the story wasn't finished. Because they were really alluding to something that like didn't happen, which I thought was weird. Um, unless I completely misinterpreted it. Um,. But yeah, it just- they just like stopped giving a shit. People were like reporting bugs and stuff and they're just like... Their response was... So it just- it makes me sad. I love Lucius so much. And I'm just... sad. I'm just sad. I wish there was more of it. I wish people liked it more, like... It's so silly. And so fun, and you know, it's just, it's just too bad. Well, Lucius, Lucius, the third Lucius came out. God, I don't know. It was a while ago. Let's see. Came out 2018. And I'm still thinking about it to this day. I just think it would have been nice if it was released and was like playable and not completely fucking broken. It's pretty broken. Everyone's just buying one thing right now and I'm about to lose it. <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. Thank you for changing my mind right there. It's just where it went never. The, the developers abandoned it. And I think that was their only game. I don't think they have any other games, so it's like... I just wonder what happened, you know? That's why I want to know if I can- can I buy the IP? Can it be mine? You guys obviously don't care about it. Let me have it. I want to take care of my boy. So I mentioned earlier how I never want to have kids. If I have a kid- let's- let's just say in some magical world I have a kid. If I have a kid and it'll end up being like a literal Satan child like, I would be heartbroken. Like, my favorite kids... Lucius... Angelica Pickles... You know, I love the kid from The Omen. I love Brahms. Not- not the Brahms, not the creepy Brahms that was, like, in the walls. Brahms that was, like, the doll that was possessed. Like, that's the type of child I'm trying to have. I just like, like, like Lucius, like he's just such a little shit and I love that, you know? And I feel like that's just what I want if I ever had a kid. Like I saw a clip, it was a really old clip of um, Super Nanny. And it was this little girl and she was such a brat, but she's British. So it's like a hundred times funnier when she's like being a little brat. And I'm just cracking up at this kid. Talking shit. <laughs> like, there was one point where she was like, you can't hit your sister. She's like, I didn't hit my sister. I pinched her. And it's just like, you little fucking shithead. Like, I just find that so entertaining. And like, if I have a kid and they're just nice and normal, like, you know, like they don't have a personality and they're just chill, I'd just be so annoyed. I'd be like, I don't know, go fucking knock over, like, something in a store and let me, like, you know, and pretend like you're all sweet and innocent. Like, that's the kind of- that's the kind of shit I think is hilarious. And I need my kid to entertain me if I'm gonna have them around.
Not gonna lie, this sushi is making me bang. That was a good choice. It'll be even better when I can have a full fridge full of it. Made fresh daily. By me. Look at I made all of those rolls. At the very least, like, I'm not... I'm not against grocery store sushi, but they have to have a place to make it, you know what I'm saying? Like my, like, my grocery store, like, you can see the people making the sushi, and they might make it, like, once every, like, four days. Because you'll see some of those things on the shelf and they'll be like, discount five dollars, don't get those. But there is, like, a spot for them to be making sushi, and you'll see them make the sushi, and I'm like, okay, I can trust this, you know what I mean? If you're just seeing sushi on a shelf and no one's around to make it, don't get it. I know it's convenient. Just don't do it, man. What did you complain about? No oil? Alright, well, at the end of the day, what do you want me to do? Food poisoning twice and it was sushi. Damn, that sucks. I've only ever had to deal with food poisoning once, and that was not the greatest thing in the world, but... You know. I feel like if Sushi gave me food poisoning, I'm just gonna be like, I, I, gotta, I just gotta power through this, you know? I will not be giving it up anytime soon. Maybe find a new sushi place, but... I heard that, um, Costco is supposed to be... Like having like a like a sushi counter, which is exciting because if I can get a lot of sushi for fairly cheap, I'm so into it. Quick Star? I'm um, I've never heard of that place. Hi, Jamie. Hey, you and girl. She's the best fucking customer I've ever had. Perfect change in cash. That's crazy. At 9 p.m. at night. Girl. I love her. I've never had a, uh, one of those bowls. One of those bowls sounds disgusting to me. I don't know what it is. All of the ingredients rolled up into like a little thing for me to bite into. Delicious. A bowl of it? I don't want that. <laughs> I just don't want it. What are they called? Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't want that. I want it. <laughs> I don't want that. The- oh, I was about to close my store. Sir, what are you doing? Are you stuck? Let me help you out. What's... what's happening? Did you want something from this? There's... Sir, so there's just french fries in there. Did you want some chicken? Is that what you wanted? He's like, I know you have it. He's like, I know you have chicken, and it's supposed to go here. Where is it? I mean, you got what you wanted, sir. Okay, thank you. Please don't come back. That was really weird for me. It's kind of scary, spooky. It's weird. Weird guy. <laughs> okay, we made seven hundred dollars. That that makes me feel good. I'm, I like to have money, so that's nice. Um, I think though, 
Oh my god, my water's out. Look at this. I think I'm done for the night. Um, I'll probably be back tomorrow. Hold on, first we must save. We must save before things get real bad. They lose all my progress. That would be heartbreaking. Did it save? Yes. Um, thank you guys for hanging out for a little while. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow. I'll be looking for stuff for Wednesday stream and then probably playing more. More Supermarket Stimulator. Uh, I'll also be putting up the video on YouTube, so if you don't want to... If you... I don't know. If you're here, you probably already saw it. But it's up there if you give a shit. Um, thank you guys. For everything. Thank you for subscribing and all of that. Um, yeah, you guys can hear my... Fucking incredible joke again, okay? Okay, bye everyone, bye. Good night.